Would you like to be queen for a day? Oh, no, wait a minute. That's an old television show that John Barilla knows about. That was uh, Queen for a Day. We want to know, do you, Rob Lynn, live? I'm going to say it again, say it again and again and again. Are you a Rob Lynn liver? I know you are. So do you, Rob Lynn, live? I know it. I know it. I can feel it in my toesies. You are a Rob Lynn live or you wouldn't even be here tonight. Woo! Uh-oh. <clears throat> oh, boy. Uh, doggies. We'll just say doggies. All right. Welcome, everybody, to day 605 of consecutive Rob Lynn lives. Today is Saturday, the 20th day of April, 2024. That's 2024. And you are tuned in to the Rob Lynn Live Network's production of Roblin Live and Ali. The Wonder Dog. It's all true. Truer than true. Uh, first off, a few thank yous real quickly. Michael Chatta, thank you very much for being a moderator, a monitor, and everything else you are, including the best at using uh, emojis. And thank you for all you do. It's good stuff, and we appreciate you. Thank you to Alex Sojib, who's been making videos for the Robin Live Network. We're very grateful to you, Alex. Hopefully you're watching tonight. If not, you're going to catch the replay. I know how you do it, dude. I know how you do it. So thank you to you, Alex. Uh, thank you to John Barilla for his support. Thank you to the other uh, monitors and moderators. Uh, Roy Davies, of course. Uh, is Sadananda one as well? Sadananda does? No. Kishal Pegu. Oh, Kishal Pegu. Uh, John is Barilla. One. John Barilla, I mentioned. Karina yes. Karina Lance. Karina Lance. Oh, the Lance girl. All right. Thank you to all of you for what you do for us. It's much appreciated. And uh, let me uh, get the prompter up so I uh, don't mumble, stumble, and bumble. So we said good morning. Oh, no, we said good evening. We should say good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. And this is just a hello to all of you joining us from around the globe. We appreciate it very much. Now, we're happy to say we have a topic tonight. Ah, there's a shocker. <laughs> yeah, we've had 605 topics, uh, consecutive topics, with uh, I think only one or two that were repeated, and they weren't repeated verbatim. So. Let's call it 603. I like 605, nice uneven number. So 605 it is. Our topic this evening. Now get ready for this. This is something that's been needed all throughout on passive, and we feel this is the right time and the right place to get it done. And we're going to be talking about how to host an O Connect. Now, all of you who have purchased O Connect need to know how to host. Many of you don't. We get questions all the time about this. Well, tonight is your lucky night. If you know anybody who is having any difficulty, either hosting, co-hosting, uh, being a panelist, whatever, this is the place tonight to get the correct truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, and the best information on the planet about the OES, from OES, I should say, uh, the OES Asia Pacific Group, and that would be one Sifu Francis Tay, who is uh, Sifu number one, Francis Tay, and Sifu number two, I don't want to call him junior, uh, Sifu number two, Chris Tarzan, techie guy, Tiazone. So those two guys will be along in just a couple of minutes. I'm going to keep my remarks short tonight. I uh, know that's a shocker. Uh, just so that we can have as much time with these two gentlemen as possible. Now, these two guys have been training right along since O-Connect came out, uh, really made its debut on September 1st, full debut on September 1st. Each day it's gotten tweaked, it's gotten uh, pumped up, it's gotten uh, uh, things have been made clearer, stronger, louder. Uh, easier to see, and these guys have been on top of all that. I mean on top of it, and uh, which reminds me, the OES classroom will be on Tuesday uh, morning, Tuesday morning, our time, 9 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time with Sifu Francis, uh, Michelle Comstra, and, of course, Sifu number two himself, Chris Tiazone. 
and uh, along with many, many people who come from all over the globe for the training. So that's a good place to be on Tuesday. Now, it's Tuesday night uh, uh, in the Asia Pacific area, like Philippines, uh, sunny Singapore, Myanmar, I believe Thailand as well, Cambodia, Vietnam. So that's a good thing. Be here for that on Tuesday and you will learn something. I don't care how much you think you know, uh, 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 you can always learn. And I'm a perfect example of that. Here I am sitting here on my perch, uh, allowed to speak out to all of you guys. And I think I know a fair amount. Sometimes I think I know a lot, but you know what? Every time I go to a training, and tonight will be no exception, I'm going to learn something. And I'm going to take it to task and I'm going to make sure I use it. Now, if you don't use it, you lose it. You've heard that phrase probably from your parents mm -hmm. or your brothers and sisters or aunts and uncles or grandma and grandpa or cousins. Well, if you don't use it, you're going to lose it. You're going to lose track of how to do it. So tonight, with the top topic being how to host an O-Connect event, an O-Connect Connect, whatever you want to call it, this is the place to be. So gather around. Uh, you might call a few of your uh, on Civian global affiliate friends and tell them, hey, Roblin Live on Saturday nights got to connect training. So you want to be here if you can. All right. Now, as I mentioned, we're going to make our remarks brief as I continue to talk. Uh, it'll be followed by the most, and I say the most and the best up to date O Connect training anywhere on the planet followed by community time, uh, time permitting. We'll have community time where you, the attendee, can be not just an attendee, but you can join the panel. You can show your video. You can uh, uh, blast out your audio. You can do both or neither. You can just come on the panel and listen if you want. But you know what? We'd like to get as many of you on the panel tonight because what a grand place to ask Q&A is going to be. Oh, ask your questions and get answers. So the Q&A will follow the presentation, of course. And then time permitting, uh, and if the deaf community is here tonight, any representatives uh, such as uh, Cecil or Deb or Patty uh, and anyone else who might come along, we'd love to have them. And uh, we'll see as time goes on. And then, of course, at the end, our baritone. We have a resident baritone. How many webinars do you go to or chats where there's a resident anything? Resident baritone. Well, right here, right now, tonight, our resident baritone will be along. Hopefully, John will have his vocal cords in uh, sync with uh, his lips. And it won't be just lip syncing. He'll actually be singing. So thank you, John, for that. Please pray for Ash. We say this every night. We mean it. We say it every day. Play, pray for Ash, his lovely wife, Ashmahan, and the two boys, Omar and Yusuf. Yusuf, formerly known as Chunky, or as I used to call him, the Chunkster. We want to thank everybody on YouTube right now. Uh, there are, let me double check, 31 watching on YouTube, and let's take a peek what we got here. We have 24. All right. Wow. So there's more on YouTube. Wow. 55. Yeah. That's very unusual. Mm -hmm. So uh, bring your family, your friends, whoever you want to catch some good, good information tonight. All right. So also pl uh, pray for the uh, tech team, the media team and the support team, and especially those in uh, Dubai who on the 15th. Uh, received one heck of a storm. There were tornadoes, more than one. There was heavy winds uh, approaching 100 miles an hour plus, and there was rain. They got, I think they got, over a foot of rain in a 24-hour period. That's a lot. Uh, check the videos on YouTube if you want. They seem to be very accurate. Shows airplanes with the wheels underwater, not able to take off, only able to move on the ground. So there were trees uprooted. There were building glass. Uh, wow. broken. Powerful. So uh, fortunately for on passive, our offices are on the tippy top, 151st floor, I believe. And uh, so we didn't suffer any damage that I know of, windstorm or rain. So very blessed there. All right. Thank That's you. why we're at the top. Yeah. All right. Announcement wise, I'm going to make this very brief, but it's very important. 
We're now in a 10-day extension. O-Connect is extended until April 30th, 30 April 2024. Oh, for, or thereabouts. It could be sooner uh, or it could uh, extend again, but we're hoping and we're expecting that this may be, may be, M-A-Y, as in could be, our last extension. So we'll have to see. We'll wait and see. Thank you for your patience and understanding with this. But as you can see, O Connect and O Mail and O Net and O Trim. And if you're in that 14 day uh, O Tracker or seven day O Tracker uh, uh, free trial, you're seeing improvements and uh, uh, little tweaks here and there, which are absolutely stunning. Stunning. So uh, if you haven't migrated, come on now. Come on. You got till September 1st to migrate. So get it done before then. Uh, you might as well share in the apples, which are available. Sign the NDA and the affiliate agreements. Check out the OnPassive newest website, if you will, please. And check out the OnPassive YouTube channel, as well as check out Mr. Mohammed William Nazal on X, formerly Twitter, where he has a blog. He makes comments, and I believe there's even been videos about OnPassive on Twitter. So, oh, excuse me, on X. So, if you know of anyone needing any on passive help, you know the drill. Helping the one helps us all. So, helping one helps us all. Now, also, log into your OES and stay on top of all things on passive. There's a ticker uh, in the, uh, uh, excuse me, OES section. And in O oh, Founders, there's still the pop ups, and they do occur. Attend webinars and chats as time allows, please. Subscribe to OConnect when you can. We do know, we acknowledge, we're experiencing ourselves to a degree that times are uh, a little bit difficult financially. Uh, let me give you a perfect example. Uh, last time we got toilet paper or toilet tissue for the bathroom, uh, it was uh, $15 for 32 rolls. Very reasonable at one of our uh, sh stores that we go to, Costco, and we also go to Sam's. Well, at Sam's today, that was $33 plus tax. $35, it almost doubled. Almost doubled, or did double. That's crazy, right? That is crazy. The half and half went up another 89 cents. I didn't get it today. I need half and half for my coffee. Uh, I can't drink it black. Uh, that naked coffee just doesn't get it for old Robbie boy. So, uh, the half and half went up almost a dollar, and the toilet tissue went up from, uh, like I said, fifteen, sixteen dollars all the way to thirty-five with tax. So uh, the times they are changing, and I, I keep hearing this on the news, and I'm not going to blast the news, but don't give me fake news that the economy is better anywhere in the world when people are paying outrageous prices for things. Fortunately, for those of us who are within on passive and our global affiliates. Uh, those uh, lean times financially are going to get better very shortly. Now, without further ado, I'd like to introduce, I believe, uh, let's see, is Francis here yet? Not yet. Okay, I'd like to introduce Mr. Chris Tiazone. Uh, Chris is of the Philippine Islands, one of many, many islands. He's on the southern tip, I believe, of uh, the Philippines home of uh, pancit, which is one of my favorite dishes. Hold the shrimp, hold the crab, hold the lobster, bring on the chicken or the beef. I love pancit. They're the thin noodles, and they are good. Not a whole lot of carbs there, so even old chubby here can have those. Now, if you look at my face, look at this. The double chin seems to have been going away. Now, I'm not bragging, but I'm not lagging either. We're working on this uh, diet program. Uh, and the occasional fast. It's a daily fast for so many hours. So thank you to those of you who are on the carnivore diet who turned us on to the fasting thing. And uh, we're happy to do it. And quite frankly, the longer you do it in terms of days, the easier it gets. Now, as I said, without further ado, let's bring in the one, the only, the Sifu Master number two. I want to call him Junior because I'm old enough probably to be his grandpa. 
sad commentary there. Uh, but let's bring on uh, Chris Tiazone. And Chris, give me one minute. I have to get rid of my prompter so we can do this properly. Just a moment, please. Take your time. And I don't like taking my time because Chris is on a mission. And Chris, if you would uh, go ahead and unmute and bring it, brother. Let's talk O-Connect. Let's talk how to host. Okay, thank you very much, Rob. Can you hear me clear? I'm just gonna check my le uh, microphone level sound. Okay. Uh, you are you are Lima Chicken, as we say in the Air Force, loud and clear. All right. Uh, thank you very much for inviting me uh, to this uh, event, and uh, and my task now is uh, to present uh, this one. Uh, I'm high, I'm having to uh, share a, s a presentation slide. And here it is. I'm going to maximize for a while for everyone to see. OK, this is my topic. Uh, I know it's uh, um, not real. It, it, I know it's related to uh, how to host an all connect event. But this would be an added value for, for an intro. Um, how to live stream or connect to YouTube. So yeah, that this how I'm. Uh, this is my topic for as a start for a start. Okay, so as we can see, O Connect dashboard. You just click new event, the the blue one on the on the bottom left hand side. So new event upcoming join event so it's the blue one uh, on the left side okay after clicking that um you'll be presented the the this dialog box it's not a dialog box it's a page wherein you have to fill out uh the the field boxes there um the uh, i'm gonna expand for a little while uh, the title, enter the title there on that field box. The next uh, one is the webinar agenda. Uh, of course, the, there are asterisks there. You just have, uh, it means you, it is uh, required to fill, fill out uh, some text. And of course, the time schedule, uh, uh, the time schedule there, enter, uh, choose the date and the time and the duration. Um, Okay, clicking those uh, um, uh, field boxes will allow you to, to to choose. Okay, so next slide. After creating event, of course, um, creating the event there um, the, on the top uh, right, there's a button there, create. After clicking that, you will be present with, presented with the events uh, tab. So it's... Uh, the events tab is uh, lo looks like this, and uh, yeah, it would uh, ha give you a list. Uh, C uh, S numbers or c serial number or series number, so zero one. So with the corresponding ID, event title, event type, date and time, created by of course uh, you as a as a, a host. Then. Um, of course, there's a there's a scroll bar below of of that, so that uh, the scroll bar is usually found here. It's a it's a thin line. You can you can navigate so that you can see to the right hand of that uh, of of that events page. So you can see the the uh, action um, column, the invite link, and the status column. So that's how to navigate uh, the browser in that in that for in that size. So um, uh, you you just use the scroll bar to go to the right side. So after that, um, after clicking this um, uh, this uh, start button under the action column, you can. Uh, uh, you, you will be seeing this uh, page. How would you like to join? 
of course, uh, I click continue using browser. Okay, so that's, uh, that's then of course, this uh, uh, page will uh, uh, appear according to what I uh, place in the event title, it will, uh, it will reflect there, explore O connect. And of course, uh, start the webinar, uh, click that green button. And you'll be presented with this uh, oconnect.ai host view. Okay, so this uh, this is the this how it looks like when uh, the browser size is in in that uh, uh, in that way. Okay, the the more options can be found uh, by clicking on the bottom left corner. It's like a it's like this it's a it's like a window uh, with a blue square okay so uh, it will expand the, the the buttons the the footer buttons that that's uh, uh, that's how it looks like and of course with this uh, slide i'm showing you how to maximize the browser view how to maximize it is here in in the windows operating system you click on the top right uh, the this box this this kind of a little box uh, in the middle of that minimize button and that close button when you click that this will be uh, the 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 browser size in uh, maximize browser view all right so okay so i i returned i returned it to restore down by clicking it again that uh, that button on on the top right corner so when cl clicking that again will give you this restore down view all right so that's how to navigate that browser uh, i'm using chrome by the way so on the more options here on the, uh, on the bottom left hand side click start streaming okay so when you hover your mouse pointer it will uh, uh, show you what's the name of that uh, of, uh, button on okay so next this is a uh, an oconnect uh, reference from the manual for streaming click on that uh, icon so yeah it's located here when it's in a maximized view it is on usually on the uh, uh, on al already in the middle okay so note youtube streaming is available for upgraded users only so take note of that then a pop up appears this is how it looks like and uh it's just uh using the reference from the oconnect manual and select the preferred screen to share there are three three types of uh, uh, uh preferred screen it is the entire screen um the system applications before it is called windows now in the oconnect manual it's it says system applications then the third one is the uh, browser tabs okay so there are also buttons below as we we will uh, go uh, proceed click on the toggle button beside also allow tab audio to share audio so that is this is the one uh, that uh, that it means toggle button it should be on the on position in the blue uh, color click on the share to share the screen that button so it's again it's coming from here from this pop up so this one on the bottom uh, right that is that is the the icon okay you can click uh, the close button to cancel the action okay after that a confirmation toaster message appears on top right corner of the screen you will be noticing that then 
The next one is a streaming screen appears. Okay, so those are the images from the OConnect manual. And next would be click on stop streaming to stop the streaming. So usually it is here. Uh, this one, there, there's a floating message here on the bottom center. Okay, that's that's the stop streaming. You can also click um, the this this button on the footer. Uh, click that again; it will also stop the streaming. Or simply click this uh, uh, red button there. Okay, so back to my O Connect live stream to YouTube user experience. What I am showing you uh, uh, the three three slides earlier is from the OConnect manual, the, but uh, recent uh, in in this recent uh, days or months, I've been um, experiencing this one. A pop up appears. Just allow OConnect.ai to see this tab and allow tab audio. So this one, this one allow, and of course. Uh, it is in the it is in the toggle on position. It's in the blue one. Okay. Then there would be a live uh, uh, indication there in the top center. It, okay. So of course, uh, in in this manner, uh, because I've already signed into my uh, Gmail and YouTube account. This is how it, it looks like for me. Uh, but as a uh, when you are allowed by the YouTube by your YouTube account to live stream O Connect, it by the next time it will uh, go uh, go through seamlessly uh, without that signing in to your YouTube. Yes. Yes. So now uh, going back, I have to go to my. Uh, uh, YouTube channel content. So in the live tab, just uh, refresh the browser page to see the live activity. So uh, YouTube, I'm now using this one because, uh, as you may ha might have noticed, in this uh, in this uh, browser tab browser window, I already opened my my YouTube channel content. The first first tab is the uh, on passive website, the second one is the dashboard. Usually, I close this dashboard so that I will not accidentally show screen this tab. So, next one is the oconnect.ai, which is uh, the dashboard, uh, rather. And this one, the fourth tab, is the uh, is the one that I'm attempting to to screen share to 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 live stream. Then the fifth tab is the the YouTube channel content, so that's where I'm coming from with this slide. So of course I'm just gonna click that, and uh, I blurred out the some some uh, list there below, and just refresh so that you can see this uh, live event uh, uh, live stream dash o connect. So you'll be you'll be by this time you can click the three dots the three dots is uh, usually here on in in this in this um, beside the title usually it's located here the three dots will allow you to edit the title and description so of course uh, i already uh, uh, put it there explore o connect and uh, the description I just titled, uh, put there. This is to demonstrate and present how to to live stream on your YouTube channel. So of course, after uh, putting it, filling that out, I have to um, I have to also on the go, going to the video details. There's also a video details uh, in in that three dots after 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 uh, re renaming your um renaming that um that uh, ti title okay 
So you just have to scroll down on the video details and click no, it's not for kids. So this is how it's done. So just click that uh, circle. Then of course, click save on the top right hand. Okay, in the top right hand, there's that button, save. And um, now you can, on the browser window, click restore down on the top right corner. I already demonstrated that uh, uh, minutes ago. And on video details, click the video link there as shown here on the right hand side. Okay, so it's just here. And after the redirection to another tab, so notice um, it has already um, added. Okay, the, re the redirection tab is already there. Uh, and after that, the YouTube in the YouTube interface appears. Just click mute sound icon. You don't want to hear um, uh, double sound on your uh, headphone or or its external speaker. That's the reason. So, what I do as a user experience in o live streaming O Connect to YouTube, I separate the YouTube interface to the side by how click and drag the tab browser. So I just uh, grab this one and click and drag and push it down. So th this is how it looks like now. In the search box, this is important for, for your sound settings. In the search box, sound settings on Windows uh, operating system, uh, just search sound settings. Yeah, type sound settings on the bottom left corner here. Okay, so I typed it there. On the sound settings, scroll down to click sound control panel. So I just scroll down and I see this one. This is important for you to have a good sound check while live streaming on YouTube, okay? So on just click sound control panel. With this one on the sound control panel, go to the recording tab. Playback, recording tab, sounds. We want you to go here. I want you to go there. So these are the, the the microphones that I have in my device, uh, which is I have a, a headphone, which I'm using now, and I disabled the speaker, the external speaker of my laptop. So just on just click on the recording tab, and you'll be presented with this. Okay, so on the recording tab, click properties. The properties is here. And on the microphone properties, click Levels tab. So that this is the Levels tab. OK. So now it is uh, disabled because uh, I clicked that earlier. On microphone properties, make sure to check Unmute in order to be heard on YouTube after enabling mic on OConnect. So of course. I floated the different uh, system applications for you to, to see that this is uh, uh, unmuted. And also, I unmute also on my uh, OConnect microphone. All right? So, you, so that uh, uh, things will go well. OK, if, it's, uh, if you're going to unmute it, there should be a red. And also, you can, you can un unmute on on the oconnect.ai so on microphone properties make sure to check mute in order not to be heard on youtube after disabling mic on oconnect so you don't want to be uh, he heard uh, uh, um, uh, si sipping coffee or talk talk to your uh, uh, housemate etc or uh, accepting a call so be sure to 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 mute this one to mute your sound microphone on your microphone properties okay so because uh, you're already uh, live streaming on youtube so and of course uh, 
uh, with all that system application or windows uh, open, you can reposition the microphone properties system application so that it is visible on your screen while live streaming to mute or unmute. Notice that the this uh, YouTube uh, one, I can see the chats that will be flying over there and we'll, we'll see in 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 real time or just uh, a delay of 10 seconds uh, people will be is chatting there if or your followers your viewers so that you'll you can respond immediately immediately to their engagement yes so that's the reason of, re, of repositioning the the windows okay so Thanks for listening. Um, for the screen capture source, it is from the OConnect manual as of uh, March 14 of 2024, uh, record, reverse, record revision 2.1. So uh, thank you very much again. Back to you, Rob. All right, uh, if I'm unmuted, am I? Okay, if you could go ahead and now send over to Francis. It did not go through from my phone. I did. The speaker link, thank you, Francis. You should be coming in any second now, uh, if you can hear us. Wow, great presentation, uh, Chris. Uh, uh, once we have Francis here and he completes uh, his part of the presentation, uh, we will go to community time. And uh, as we, as, well, you may not be able to see, but uh, Participant-wise, right now we have uh, 31 in OConnect, 31, and in uh, on our YouTube uh, channel, uh, there are 46. So we have 77 right now watching, which is cool. We like that. Uh, you uh, Now it's 41. You 41 who are watching on YouTube, if you're an OES, please slide over uh, and uh, and uh, pick up the attendee link we'd love to have you here and then we'd love to have you uh, also as a panelist uh, in addition uh, let me see let me see let me see okay so yeah there's 40 yeah there's uh, roughly 77 watching now which is cool between the two uh, spots uh, our youtube channel roblinlive.com and if you're on YouTube watching this, now go to Roblin, roblinlive.com or go to roblinlive.ai, AI, and uh, either one of those, click on them. They're both clickable. It'll bring you to the registration page for the OES. Now, just by registering, in other words, getting an O-mail, which is the one of your choice, and a password you're under no obligation to purchase anything that's important to know you can attend uh, oconnex but in order to host an oconnect you have to be subscribed to oconnect so i was uh, looking to see if i see francis do you see francis francis uh, hopefully you got the link that Lynn sent that has the um, speaker link as well. Righty. Well, while we're at it, while we're waiting for Francis to hop on, I would like to say that uh, Tuesdays, we mentioned, will be the OES uh, uh, classroom, classroom. And uh, that starts at 9 p.m. Asia Pacific time on Tuesday or uh, if you're in Florida, Florida, or anywhere on the East Coast, the Eastern Daylight Time, as well as in Canada on the Eastern side, is at uh, 9 a.m. on Tuesday. And uh, there's a, uh, always a, a topic there to get things started, and then there's a grand Q&A, so it's a good place to be. Uh, we may see a continuation of tonight with a little more information from both Francis uh, and Chris. So that all being said, well, I might as well remind you about uh, tomorrow is uh, Heroes, which uh, comes on at uh, 2 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Uh, that's the only one we know of about tomorrow, but check in the back office and you'll see probably a host of uh, uh, webinars and chats. Uh, there's been averaging between 30 and 45 a day 
So there's a good information being provided by many. But if you want the best, don't forget the rest. If you want the best, come right here to Roblin Live or to OES Asia Pacific, and you will get the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. I think we should say a few hellos while we're waiting. Is that okay sure. with you, Lynn? All right. Uh, I can actually do that uh, right here. We'll say hello to the folks in the O-Connect. Right. Oh, we'll do O-Connect first. All right. Sounds good to me. Thank you for that. Here we go. Let's say a few hellos right and here. Francis is here. Welcome Francis back, is please. here. All right, Francis. Glad you're here, brother. Uh, we're going to say a few hellos, and then we'll swing right over to you, sir. Fern LaHaye in the house, as well as Oni Loney, also known as Loney. She's here from the United States. France Marceline is here from Florida, USA. Isabel Bailey's in the house. Michael Chad, of course, from uh, the Midwest of the United States is here. We appreciate everything he does. Catherine uh, Fryson is here, as well as uh -oh, Philo Darshini. Philo Darshini. I'm doing that phonetically. I think I botched it, but it's Miss uh, uh, Subudhi. Subudhi, you're, we're glad you're here, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you from India all the way from India, where it's morning time there. Thank you for getting up so early. Cecil, we're in the house of our deaf community. Keiko Hoshina from Japan is here, of course. And hopefully she's not on the bus and is home since it's Sunday there in Japan. And we've got Naga Sudarsan here. Duda, let's see, his last name is Duda Skula. Welcome, sir. We're glad you're here from India. Uh, Lynn is much better at pronouncing the Indian names. Henry Horn in the house. Oh, look at this. Four days in a row, four nights in a row. Elizabeth Priscilla Bade is here from Papua New Guinea. Welcome, 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 ma'am. And uh, uh, Venkat Tola is here. Krishnavan, thank you for being here, ma'am. Also from India. Man, we're blowing it up in India, aren't we? Good stuff. We're glad you guys are here. It's a grand place to learn, and uh, it's well. We're just happy you're here. Uh, Don uh, Swihart is here from the USA in the fine state of Ohio, formerly of Michigan. Frank Rowe in the house from West Virginia, USA. Cynthia Deering from Canada is here. And Double Mel is here. Mel Marcano from Canada. Olusumbo is here. Kuye. And Nagaraj is here. Man, that guy is, is here first all the time. And Armin Hogue in the house on two devices from Canada. Thank you, Armin, very much. Also here is Deborah Long of our deaf community, John Barilla, uh, our singing baritone, also known as the Tin Man, JJB Tin Man. Carmela Schwartz is here. Sadananda Das is here, our dear friend. Welcome, sir. Pat Green, also known as Dorothy. Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. She's Dorothy. No, she's actually Pat Green, and she's from Kansas. Uh, Angela LaLand is here from the USA, and Azmuddin Mohammed uh, Ma'araf Ma is here from, not sure of that, is that Australia? No, I've got that. Sorry, sir. Uh, let us know in the chat uh, what country you're from. I thought I knew that flag, but I botched that one. All right, let's uh, go here. And uh, of course, we have Mr. Francis Tay here now. Uh, I'm here, Lynn's here, and Mr. Sifu Chris Tiazone is in the house as well. We just did a grand presentation. And uh, without further ado, we'll say some more hellos if we could. Is that all right with uh, the folks on YouTube, real quickly? Yeah. All right, let me do that. And say and thank you to Francis for the super sticker. All right. Thank you for being in the chat to know that. Thank you, Francis. Very kind of you, brother. We appreciate you very much. And I think you know that. We have 50 watching, and here we go. Uh, 50 viewers. I want to take a peek at who they are. And for some reason, it's not letting me do that. Hmm. Hmm. Let me help you. Okay. I clicked on 50 watching. That would make us up to uh, 85 at the moment. Yeah. Not too shabby. Keep on. Live oh, live chat. All right. Thank you, everybody, for bearing with me. Let's say hello to Sean Don is here. Uh, Ilya Sue is here. 
Uh, Amar Shand is here. Job Rill, of course, one of our moderators. Thank you. Heart Centered Living is here with Mr. Souza. All right. Glad you're here, uh, Mario. We're, we miss you. We're glad you're here tonight. Uh, Sarah Swati's in the house. The Barma. Oh, yeah. And Roy Davies, one of our moderators, is here from the west coast of Florida, USA. Irena Stexal is here. First girl always. Uh, Thana, Thanuja Moment is here. So the Moments are here tonight. Exactly. We all like that very much. Uh, we mentioned Michael Chatta and Irena and Roy. Let me go back the other direction and make sure I don't miss anybody because we're not into missing people. We're into saying hi. I mentioned, oh, Rajesh is here. Hello to Rajesh. We're glad you're here as well. Uh, mentioned Michael Chatta. Jimmy Mara just popped in at the. Who did? Jeannie Mara. All right, Jeannie. Glad you're here as well. Marver. Marver. Okay. And, and Frank Medina. Rowe is in the house from West Virginia, eh? Medina, USA. Medina S. Also just popped All in. All right. Medina is here. The crowd is growing. Let's see, we're at 85 right now and growing. So that's pretty much everybody there. And, uh, oh, Ralston McKenzie's here. Hello, brother. Glad you're here. Thank you. Hopefully you can join us uh, on the panel tonight. We love when you drop by. Thank you. And I think I got everybody. Oh, Kushal Pegu is here. Wait a minute. Don't want to miss him. He's one of our moderators. All right, Kushal. Thank you. Uh, Galleon is here. Another moment is here. Uh, not a moment in time goes by when the moments aren't here. That's Thank you right. for being here. Mm -hmm. And uh, Ram Prakash is here. Sajid is here. Oh boy. The, the crowd is growing. Thank you. Now in YouTube. That's a good crowd. Yep, 52 in YouTube is remarkable. We've had 193 comments in the chat on O-Connect. How about that? And 55 messages on YouTube. So thank you to everybody. And I think it's time that I put a lid on what I'm saying, and let's welcome the Sifu himself, Sifu numero uno, Francis Tay, from sunny Singapore. I'm not going into that long dissertation of all your credits because everybody knows you by now. Thank you. Thank you, Rob. So uh, apologize for being late here. Uh, it's, it's always interesting to, to note that whenever I call appointment, you know, you got something pop up, you know. Mm -hmm. got another appointment got something pop up again. You know? That's life, isn't it? That's so I, I, I think I don't, in future, I don't want to make appointment, you know. You <laughs> keep doing funny. what you're doing because what you do is right. So all is yeah. good, brother. Uh, anyway, uh, thank you, Chris, Chris, for taking the lead. You, know? you are already a, a seafood senior now. Uh, your presentation, I was listening on the way rushing back here and your presentation Chris is awesome uh, actually you cover most of the things I, I want to say uh, let me just uh, share screen our our intention today is to help you uh, to to move a bit uh, to move a step uh, higher to become a host yeah? whether whether you you like it or not you are owning owning a fantastic and awesome product called O-Connect, right? We, we, we don't want to, to uh, waste this opportunity that is on your hand. Uh, every one of us have, a, uh, have this de desire to promote, uh, to, to hope we have a bigger dream, bigger apple, right? If you, if you have a, this dream, then there must, uh, something, to, something must happen. Uh, something must, you must do sales you must have uh, traffic so that you get increase in, increase your your so-called your, your bank bank account. So a product like O Connect you cannot miss. You cannot put aside. Yeah? Although it may be expensive, uh, but at the end of the day, you may be able to sell other other uh, uh, lower lower cost product and then come back and and uh, subscribe O Connect. Right. So by then you still need to, to know what is old connect. So I want to come uh, this morning or tonight. I want to come to you uh, as a to help you to understand the marketing aspect of old connect. Uh, not not so much of uh, playing around in the old connect. Okay. So when you 
when you have this uh, old connect, you just subscribe. Huh? Uh, Okay, once you log in to the old connect platform uh, from the OES, you will be able to see this uh, beautiful color, colorful uh, dashboard, we say, uh, dashboard. So at this moment, uh, I'll just briefly tell you that this icon, uh, don't, don't go in first, okay? Don't touch first. Uh. This one is only available by default, by default. Uh, is only available once you go in. It's a conference setting. Uh, it's not a, it's not a webinar setting. Okay, it's conference setting. That means uh, you go in live alone, and now you start to invite people. Like what Chris has already showed you, you go to the uh, participant and start to invite people by sending them, uh, sending them the email or sending them the Gmail the alternative Gmail that you have, right? If you want to host, right? let's say, uh, I don't know whether I can go in and try. Okay, I'm going and try. I hope there's, uh, uh, okay. So because it's a conference, it's only, only one, uh, you only have one conference. Uh, you can only see the window, uh, one's uh, box uh, to see how many people in the speaker room. There's no attendee uh, because you are, uh, this is by default. The go live is only for conference uh, setting, okay? Then you just, if you start the conference, right? So here you can uh, go to your, Go to your participant and click on the the top button here, the plus button, and invite your friend here. Okay, here uh, until now, you can use your your alternative email to invite your friend who are already in the OES, right? Also uh, or email either one of them. Okay, or you can copy the invitation, right, and send to your friend. But if you send by email, they will have the they will have the response or they will receive the email from the company from the system uh, that along with the the uh, conference link uh, to come in right to come into the webinar. Of course, uh, this is by permission. Uh, you must have an email or you are a user of the OEA system. Uh, the outsider who uh, you invite. They still need to have the registration uh, page huh, to sign in as a user, right? So this is very simple. If you do not need the, if you do not need the uh, attendee, then all every one of us, uh, every one of them who you invite, go to the conference room, right? That means they will have all the feature available at the bottom, right? So you will need to have. Uh, you will need to have a group of people beside you to control the room, right? To control the room. I mean, otherwise, you, while you are presenting uh, or while you are doing the talk, there are so much noise happening, all right? right. So this is uh, uh, this is uh, the the new thing that have uh, just included in our old connect, uh, which is a uh, go live, okay? So I will I will suggest uh, if you want to have a bigger group, right? Bigger group, go go by the normal way that you you come in, huh? right? I just figured out why I didn't get the email. Oh. Okay. Go by the normal way, create new event like what Chris has shown you. Create new event. And by default, again, you see the top here is conference. You tick by conference. So you just change this tick to webinar. Right? Change this to webinar. 
and then select your uh, create your title right and agenda is not a crucial thing but it, they require they require you to fill in the blank so you must put something huh? so if you if you are creating an event uh, immediately uh, live now uh, if you don't if you do not want to use a conference you use a webinar you don't need to touch you don't touch the calendar don't need to touch the, the time right the hour is you also don't need to touch because by default uh when the when you start the event they will add in another two hours by default huh? they will say uh two hours is added to, to your seminar so so uh in actual fact when you want to start a live uh if you want to go conference as, you, as i say uh, no attendee uh room huh? so if you want attendee room switch to webinar right then then everything just as normal and you, you can go and start event okay create create the event the okay, one you create the event you just go into your event config or oh, because i got another say okay right created another event okay So he, 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 he stopped my screen sharing. Oh, no, you didn't. It just stopped. You might want to keep try again. Okay, you can see the report there. Eh? Just now I click on the conference, it created one room uh, and the meeting the meeting is created. Now I created another another uh, testing, right? See, there's two. So that's why he asked me uh, is conflicts huh? because there's one one uh, one event you created. Now you created another one. So now you have two, two, um, two events created, the conference and the webinar. So we just click webinar of course as a host now uh, you you can either click this one to give to give your friend uh, to come in all the link uh, including the attendee attendee uh, link right so we, if we start the event as a host now you see two two boxes, okay, the speaker and the attendee. So this is for the host. Uh, before the meeting start, you want to to see whether how many is in the room. Uh, if, if a lot of people waiting, of course, you want to start the, start the meeting and let them wait in the room before the actual time of the event, okay? If if you are creating a on-the-spot event uh, in, now, then you don't need to, uh, no need to wait, uh, just come in here and start the event. And start the webinar right so when you are in the webinar uh when you are the, in the webinar the practice should be the first thing you should be unmute before you start your webinar unmute this one on the top the microphone unmute huh? so so everyone is everyone's uh, microphone is muted right so they can continue your your training huh? or your demonstration or any any seminar you want to uh, present okay okay i i want to let's go through the important part as a host huh? as host okay uh the feature i i just heard just now uh, chris had already mentioned to you as a host uh your desire is that every one of us uh uh here uh, in uniform huh? so because you want to present a product a product right so of course you send you send them the virtual background right the virtual background because as a host you you want whenever you take a picture uh as a testimonial as a testimonial for the future event you want to show your 
your new customer, new or your new friend, right? That you have created, uh, you you have this event, uh, you have this event or any uh, activity, so that this give you a profile, uh, a profile that uh, you not newcomer, you have a few event that you have hosted, right? Especially uh, if you are a coach, uh, you want to take a picture of the of the webinar uh, to show show them uh, how professional you are, right? So, in my opinion, the first thing you must require must require the attendee and the speaker, those who are in the speaker room, try and put up the virtual background. Uh, the virtual background too. But if you go to a VIP uh, webinar or no VIP uh, invitation, uh, dinner or what, they ask you to wear, you know, wear something uh, nice. Uh. You don't wear a t-shirt, right? You follow, you follow the desi desire of the host. So likewise, when you are invited to a, a room a webinar, uh, uh, I, I know that whenever Ash Mufara invite you, you definitely wear nice. You definitely will put on the, learn to put on the web, uh, uh, the virtual background. But somehow I don't know when the normal people like us, let me uh, host an event, people need to be told to put virtual background. Okay, to do the virtual background is very simple. I'll just go through, just go through here. Uh, because because of time that right? just click click on the virtual background icon click i load i'm load uh, for those who are on the youtube choose choose an image on a device Okay, my other device is so slow. I cannot whether you're following. Then when you see the image, make, make sure you have a uh, click on the blue, uh, click on the blue circle. Okay, click on blue circle and come down here, open your video. Come here to open the video first before you click the. Okay, open the video. All right. Then you come to the virtual background, uh, the bottom one, set virtual background. Right. Then you have the, then you have the screen. Okay. Well, in less, less than 30 seconds, you can get, get your audience to follow you and set the virtual background. Right. So this is, uh, it's good, it's good, uh, no, it's, it's good to honor the event. If you if you come into an event, if you don't know, learn learn how to pull out the event. Right? So everyone uh, in the screen is good, and we can take a picture and give give testimonial to your new customer. Right. So so here you can decide to uh, as learn learn how to use the video on the left side. Huh? Uh, the video presentation or the presentation uh, tools, huh? feature. So you will use uh, the presentation tools. You can you can either uh, download the file or the folder to the presentation. Huh? I, so I don't know why here now I, I do presentation is not showing the whiteboard. Okay. So once you download the presentation, you can also post it here. If it's a file or it's a document, right now here as a host, huh, here you can do your whatever uh, uh, you know, PowerPoint you want to say. You, know, you can just explain here on here. Especially if you have something that uh, you, know, you want people to take uh, action, huh, call to action. You want them to sign a document. You want them to to indicate their interest. Uh, this one 
this one uh, when you put a document with with two two blank space for them to sign one is you one is them uh, to agree on whatever product you want to uh, you want to purchase uh, this is a very powerful tool uh, this is a very powerful tool that in our uh, in our pipe board you can do uh, post your, your file or post your, your form here and let the other party come in and sign right remember we sh we have this demonstration by the quiz uh, right right the other or whether two or three party they can also sign especially you are doing insurance or you are doing property agent eh? no the the property agent who own who is also a uh, on passive he, he, he should use this uh, platform to showcase uh, both his his career or his job and also the uh, the on passive o connect tools uh, the video conferencing tools so they can they can tell the, your customer whether is it they are selling uh, property in other country or insurance uh, the other party can come in and agree after the presentation right after the presentation, you say, okay, now, now uh, can I have a letter of intent? Well, letter of intent is that the, the other party must sign, sign the form, letter of intent. Or uh, you, you may want to call them and say, I'm offering offering you this product, uh, which is 30, day, 30 days uh, trial, uh, 30 days trial or 14 days trial. Uh, would you want to want to come in? Is it, then give them the form to sign in and register. So this is a very powerful uh uh tools in in uh, now this is a new one in o connect okay remember that if you are inviting if you are inviting non user okay if you are inviting non user when they want to participate in your event they need to register right don't don't tell them what what are you coming for just say they're coming here uh, for the for the uh, presentation that you are presenting, you are you are if you are this uh, uh, insurance man, you are starting with, uh, I want to present to you this uh, uh, life insurance uh, product, or I want to present to you the property product. But just just they don't need to say why must I sign up. Okay, this is to get involved in the event, huh? a webinar, right? So it's very common common uh, requirement that if you go to a concert, you are given the tickets. Uh, you are given the tickets, right? E-tickets to, to enter the room. So if you are coming to an event, there must be also an invitation uh, proof, which is also E-ticket. You go and register yourself, put your name there and uh, sign up and come into the room. Right? Don't start to sell. Huh? You want to start to sell, they know that you are selling. Then they involved in the old connect uh, Oh yes, right. Just leave with them. Then after the event, after the presentation, you may just tell tell your friend or your customer. And by the way, uh, the the registration that you you came into you uh, to my webinar, uh, uh, the company this product this company offer you three free tools to use. And just use it. Uh, see how, how you feel. Just give me a feedback after that. Just tell them. And also the company say that uh, when you sign up, you saw the ten. Then old coin, and this is for you to keep. In future, if you want to to participate or or buy anything, you can use a ten old coin. Just be simple, short and sharp. Do not add in or do not be pushy. You know? uh, people say that life insurance people are very pushy. Try to be, try to show the other way of, of yourself. Huh? Tell your customer. So once you you have uh, certain if, uh, product, even you can invite. Those uh, who are those chefs who are good no? to use your to use your tools if they are not uh, on passive end, to use your your this product O Connect no? to host it and simple ask them to sign sign up okay uh, registered okay now here is also the last thing I want to show you is the attendee eh? attendee side so this this is also uh, good for the host to look at the attendance who who is in the house now the the old format we have to go to the next page to see who
who is in the room, right? So this is important because if you have someone uh, you have invited personally to, to come into your webinar and uh, without turning to the next page, you can look at the screen uh, to see to see who is in the room. If she or he in the room, you just want to say, you know, to acknowledge, thank you for coming. You know, I appreciate uh, taking time here to listen to my presentation. But you are a host, you must act as a host. Right? Be courteous and be uh, uh, be on the, uh, what's that? You, you appreciative, huh? because this is, uh, when, when people come to your webinar, appreciate them, huh? Just acknowledge them, thank you for coming. Yeah. So that, then they, they also know that you, you know they're coming, they're way here. So there's also after sales, huh? after the meeting, you want to ask for feedback. Right? I don't know whether any more things to, to add here. Of course, at the host, as now when I mentioned by uh, Chris, huh? you, you can, you know, there's also, you, there's also a, like block the, the, block the, the people, the participant or, or, terminate the participant or this hopefully because they are all invited by you then no need to block no need to terminate them <laughs> yeah. the only thing we need to do is to uh, learn how to to control the room uh, the top in here control the, the mic control the video you know yesterday yesterday uh, in my in my Asia, uh, OES Asia there was one uh, one participant on the video and uh, it's a lady, uh, she was on the bed. Right. So I, I, when I saw when I saw this, I, I switched off the, the, her video, right? right. Co-host can also switch off the video. Only co-host cannot uh, activate co-host event. Huh? If the, the other party co-host misbehave, you, you are co-host, you cannot go and do anything. No, but only the host or the second host can do it. So, so that 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 lady was not not a host or a co-host. So, uh, no, I can use a co-host my other device to to block no? because I was training. Eh? So my other device was watching the the, the audience, no? the people. So I was able to close. So you must must learn what what are the things that you can do as a host. What are the things uh, the host and the co-host can do, right? So when you when you appoint a group of co-hosts, the co-hosts, you just uh, give them a brief some uh, what, briefing, and just say that in case this happened, that happened. You as a co-host uh, can unmute and block the video, right? So you make the you make yourself and make the event more uh, professional. You are in control. So just like uh, when I was in Calcutta, two thousand people. They are, they are, when whenever someone come to the stage, everybody jumping jumping up and down. You know, so happy. So the 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 so called uh, the volunteers uh, then uh, go and tell them to sit down. Those the, the rules of the house is you're not supposed to jump up and down. But they know their duties. So so if you if you in the future create event right and you want helpers volunteers you you must give them a briefing what you require it make you look good it may look good okay okay i think i i uh enough here uh, as as i think i don't need to show the, the report huh? i think maybe, yeah, i think I, I can stop here thank you we can ask questions during the during the community time right all righty then i believe uh, i've been unmuted thank you to uh sifu francis as well as sifu uh chris very uh, very nice presentation by you both very informative uh, i picked up on something that i didn't really realize when we were doing a practice today and I'll mention it so it doesn't happen to anyone else, if that's okay, uh, Francis and Chris. Uh, when we were practicing, I gave my regular email I use for business type stuff, you know, uh, 
insurance, accounting, all that stuff, banking. Well, I didn't give my uh, O mail, number one, and number two, I didn't give my alternate email. So there's a reason why uh, I might not have gotten a response, and that's because you have to enter the proper information. So, and the proper information is if you're already in the OES and you want to be a an active uh, speaker, let's say, in Go Live, or if you want to be on a webinar uh, as a speaker and attendee, you have to give the proper information for the link to be sent to. So, uh, just a little tidbit there that I actually learned. That I just figured that out as I was thinking, uh, as you as you both were speaking. So. Thanks for uh, straightening me out on that. Uh, we'd like to go to community time. Before we do, we'd like to say thank you not only to Francis Tay for the super sticker, but to Irena Stek Sala, uh, first girl thank you, Irena. from the Ali Boy contest days. Thank you, Irena. Thank you. Very kind of you. We we appreciate you uh, uh, very much. Uh, not just your attendance, but uh, your support. And the super sticker, of course, is very well thank you, thank uh, appreciated, you. very much appreciated. So uh, as far as community time, uh, uh, I'd, I'd like to, we'd like to entertain as many questions as we can while we have both of these gentlemen here, Chris and, and uh, Sifu Francis, both Sifus actually. Uh, we'd like to have as many questions as possible. I'll be checking the uh, YouTube chat as well. Lynn, hopefully, will check the uh, O-Connect chat. And we don't want to miss anybody's question. Uh, but do come to the community time. Here's how you do it. Uh, in just a moment, Lynn will enable uh, by turning on the I want to be a speaker. I call it the I want to be a speaker button or link. And what that does is that gives you on the page where you're listed as an attendee uh, another uh, an icon. It's a, it's a gentleman, looks like a man, with a speaker hanging out of his ears. It kind of looks like this, out of his ear, out of his right ear. So all you do is click on that, and that will pop up on Lynn's screen that you want to become a speaker uh, or want to come to the panel. You don't have to speak. You don't have to show your video, but we love it when you do. But we'd love to have it. We've had... Uh, I think the highest panelists we've had at one time on a Roblin Live is about 38, which, hey, that's not too shabby. Uh, Lynn's busy, or I'd, uh, I'd have her say not too shabby. But uh, <laughs> I know the phrase. Ash even uses the phrase, so must be something to it. Not too shabby. All right, we've got uh, 50 watching on uh, YouTube, and let me check here and see how we're doing here. I thought we had 30 some odd. Oh, we've got 37. That gives us 87, not too shabby. And we'd love, love, love uh, to hear from many of you joining us on the panel. So please, uh, you can put your questions in the chat, but why not air them out on air? We'd love for you to present yourself uh, as a panelist. That'd be great. That'd be, if I can do it, you can do it, okay? I'm a nervous Nelly when it comes to some of this stuff. So I know I, you know, I, you know, I, sound off but there are times when i'm a little bit on the shy side especially if i don't know 100 percent of what i'm talking about so uh, that all being said lynn's going to now turn the button on please okay let me change the ticker uh she's changing the ticker and this tells you exactly how to do that as well thank you to again to michael chatta uh formerly known as 444 uh for for uh his uh not only the moderate moderator stuff he does and saying hello to people, but also his uh, emojis, which are absolutely stunning. So is that on now? Mm -hmm. Okay, you'll be the only one that can see that in the top right. Uh, unless you make me a second host, would I see it then? No. Okay. Okay, so the second host doesn't see who wants to come on. Only the first host, and that would be Miss Nakamoto. So, Lynn, we have take it away. Dip along. Deborah Long coming on board. Hello, D -L, Deborah. Yeah, it's your sign name. D L or D L D L D L. Welcome, 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 welcome. Next we have Fern LaHaye. Fern LaHaye in the house. Welcome, Fern. Glad you're here as well from Canada, and of course Deb is from the USA. 
here mm. we have next coming in is Onye Loni. Onye Loni, formerly, okay, that's uh, Loni for short. For those of us who had trouble the first couple of nights she was on. So Onye Loni, thank you. We're glad you're here from the USA as well. And here comes Elizabeth Bade of PNG. Four nights in a row we got Elizabeth. All right, thank you, bandwidth. Glad you're here, Elizabeth. We'd love to hear from you tonight. If, if any of you have questions, write them down or put them in your memory bank. We'd love to hear from all of you tonight. The more, the merrier. All right, here comes Pat Green. Pat Green, uh, uh, I'm not going to say her new name that I came up with to embarrass myself. I'll just say Dorothy. Dorothy, welcome. Mm -hmm. Welcome, Dorothy, from the USA. From Kansas, and that's why my husband teases her and calls her Dorothy. So people right. may not know, right? But I don't Thank use her new me. name. Hi, Elizabeth. <laughs> we see you. And hear you. We hear you and see you. Wonderful. All right, anyone else? We have now Guiana. From Guiana, our favorite uh, 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 brother from uh, Brooklyn. Welcome, Guiana. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Namaste, namaskar. Namaste, namaskar, brother. Namaskar, sir. Good evening. Good evening. Namaskar. Good sir, evening. Uh, I have a, excuse me, sir, uh, Rob, sir, and Lin, ma'am. Uh, I have a one request. Uh, Shifu, uh, 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 attraction to you also. Uh, Rudra, Rudra Prasad, uh, a few seconds before, uh, voice message sent to me. His father very serious sick uh, right now uh, in hospital, admitted. So a request to me for prayer and uh, good merits uh, donation to him for recovery early. So I request to you, uh, please all our prayer for uh, his father. You, uh, Rob, sir, you know also, Rimmam, you know also, Rudra Prasad. Right. So, All right, prayers out yeah. from, uh, so, we'll send the prayer uh, words to yeah, One minute before he sent to me, boys, oh, Mr. Bangla. So, okay, uh, not, not everybody you know. knows who he is, so we want to say Rudra Prasad both yeah. actually met Francis K in Calcutta. They got to know each other, and Rudra has been a, a very strong supporter of our show and OES. Yeah. series and he is often the main interpreter for those oes classroom webinars yeah yeah ma very yeah, very ma um, yeah. supportive and loving gentleman humble yeah. he is a professor a university professor but whenever we say professor he says oh no 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 and instead he calls francis k professor which is i think so cute but we yeah. want to say prayers for rujas and his family and his father from all of us here from the Roblin Life family. Please let uh, him know. Yeah, ma am. Am. I have also a big plan, uh, and uh, I already uh, talked to with him uh, with the uh, Sifu. I will do the uh, bigger plan to uh, help to them and donation to their for a human, a human uplifting humanity, you know. So uh we are together uh, we will do the donation to their uh, for him and uh, uplifting humanity thank you sorry interrupt to rob sir thank and ma'am thank you very much anytime brother anytime thank francis, you we love you brother francis would like to say a few words i want to give him the floor in case you want to say something francis yeah i think the you know that i also very emotional i think we also have uh, a lot of people sick this week huh? this past week uh if you know about I don't want to talk too much about Gutra. He's a very kind man. Uh, he, he, his eyesight is also not doing well, right? His eyesight not doing well. Although he's translating for us in the OES India, uh, but because his computer is down, therefore he cannot see the phone. He can't see properly the phone. So he just listen and help us to translate. You know, a, a brother who have he himself have some condition, health condition, is still willing to come up here to help us and then let, let's give give him a pray for his father and also pray for his health right and the other person i want to raise here is uh if, if you have been attending the old years in the earlier years earlier you know this lady called uh three here uh miss sim three here is our singaporean our jojo one in singapore uh 
currently he she's in hospital uh been diagnosed uh late in the late stage of uh, liver cancer right uh, so just remember her in your prayer thank you prayers out we'll get all our prayer warriors uh, to go to work now uh, prayers are needed uh, uh singapore way india way and really around the globe because uh there's so many of us as global affiliates there's probably people we don't know about so if you can do a general prayer as well as prayer for these uh, specific folks it'd be much appreciated and uh i want to say thank you publicly to those of you who wondered where in the heck i disappeared to last night uh i had uh, uh age 75 tummy itis and uh I, I i think uh the salad dressing that i ate may have been a little bit on the sour side uh and needed uh, uh nurse nakamoto who stepped to the plate she uh stuffed me with uh uh alka seltzer and then i actually she had said i needed pepto bismo and i being mr tough guy said nah i don't need that well i wound up taking a swig of that also i forgot to tell you and that really made the difference so and the prayers uh prayer does work guys thank you and i'm feeling 100 percent now i'm wide awake you haven't seen me on but three times tonight so not too shabby and uh ah, anybody else coming in oh yes there well are, let's bring them we go back to bringing people in we have uh melanie marcano Double Mel is in the house. We know we'll have a question or two from her. We want to remind everybody that Mel, especially on Mondays, uh, has uh, a training uh, and also a meet and greet combination. And I believe it's this Monday at, correct me if I'm wrong, 1700 hours, 5 p.m. Did I get that 5 right? 5 p.m. Eastern. Eastern Daylight Time. So tune into that. Uh, Lynn and I were at the first one and it was very good, very well attended. And the questions were good. The questions are very good, and we'd love to hear um, questions tonight as well. Go ahead, Lynn. So if you'd like to be attending her session, um, let us know. Yeah, just let us know. We'll give you the link. Next, we have Don Swihart and her husband, D.L. Welcome yeah. to the Swihart McConaughey Group. They are uh, high atop their home there in uh Ohio, so not high atop. They're they're in their living room, but hopefully not the basement. And here comes John Barilla, JJB Tin Man. Uh, the Tin Man is in the house. In the house. Welcome, Tin Man. Hi, Don. Glad you're here. Hi, Thank you, everybody Hi, that's putting up the background. Uh, it means a lot to us. Uh, you don't have to, but uh, it is available. Lynn puts it out every day. It's either in the what back office or in our uh wait a minute it's in our facebook group and, your facebook group and chris or francis either one of you can just go ahead and share share the file of the background that'd be nice and helpful that'd be good chris if you don't mind doing that so now, everybody has it yes it's so convenient when you click on it it goes right to your downloads and all you gotta do is uh, uh go to as francis spoke about earlier just go to the uh uh, the eighth button from the left, and you'll see where you click on the background. What is it? A D V I. Am I getting that right? A I V B G. Like I said, I don't know what I'm talking about. Sometimes it's A V B B G. A -I -B -B -G blah blah. A I. But like I said, it's the button that looks like a mountain with a guy at the top. How's that? All right. It's the eighth one from the left. Okay. Click on that, and then all you got to do is click on the upload button, and. Uh, uh, go ahead and pull up the download and you'll see that and all you got to do is click on it and then go to the bottom right and click on the blue button and as you can see the file has now been shared with you it appears right on your screen all you need to do is click on download all right so anybody interested in that please do it if you're not interested in that don't worry about it we'll catch you on the flip on doing that no problem anybody else coming yes well let's hear from you we have Greg Hill coming in. Greg Hill from the San Juan Islands, USA. Welcome, Greg. We're glad you're here, Mr. Gifster. Hi, Fern. Hi, and there's DL. Fern. Hello, Fern. Thank Hi. you for the putting Hi. up the background. Hi, Don and DL. Don and DL are here. And hello to Cecil Weir. Cecil Weir. All right. Cecil is in the house. Uh, time permitting, uh, 
uh, Cecil does have a few words that we may do uh, sign-wise. So uh, stand by for that. We'll just have to wait and see how the time goes. Uh, either way, it'll be tonight or Monday, I guess, if Cecil's available. So thank you, Cecil. All right. Next, we have Carmela Schwartz coming in. Carmela Schwartz, uh, the fire girl, fire, fire, fire. She's from Israel, the beautiful country of Israel. And uh, welcome, Carmela. She, I know she's going to have a question or two. All right. Who else, Lynn? Next, we have Bilash Roy. Balash Roy is in the house. From India. From India. Welcome, Balash. Uh, I almost said Sawadi, but Sawadi is Thai. I, I meant to say namas, Namaste, Namaskar. Balash, welcome, brother. Welcome, welcome. Hi, Carmela. Carmela is in the house. Shalom to you. Uh, let's see, it's already okay. Sunday there, so the Sabbath has passed, but welcome. And okay. it looks like it's still dark there, Carmela. All right. Uh, who else is coming? Yes. Let's welcome David Switzer. David Switzer, the Kansas City Chiefs, probably one of the biggest fans there. David, welcome, brother. We're glad you're here. We love it when you come. Hopefully you've got a Kansas City shirt on, which I if I haven't seen your video yet, but chances are you do. Right. Well, you got the hat on. That's close enough, brother. All right. Who else? Let's welcome Franz Marcelin from Ocala. Uh, uh, from Florida. USA in Florida, France. Marceline is in the house. Welcome, France. And here comes Anush Kumar. Anush Kumar is in the house. Anush, welcome, sir. Welcome, and, and we namaskar, see, namaste. We now see Mohammed Ashraf Ansari. Uh, our guy with the beard, is that our guy? Yes. All right, Mohammed. Hi, David. Mr. Ansari in the house. There's David, there's France, man, and there's Greg. All right, I like this. I like it. We're at 41 participants here and 52. We're at 93. I knew we could do it. I knew it. I knew it. So good job. Thank We're you. up to 93 watching now, which is cool. It's cool. Here, here comes Pedro Estrada. Pedro Jose Estrada Salatas. All right, welcome, Pedro. We're glad you're here. He's from Maryland, Gaithersburg to be exact. Not far from where I used to live in Silver Spring, Maryland. All right. Very nice panel. All right. The panel is growing by leaps and bounds. Have we slowed down now? Yeah, we got 23 of us total. 23? Not too shabby. Woo! I knew you'd remember your line. All right. Okay. Now is a good time if you have a question. Uh, and don't think that it's not important or it's not valuable to somebody. Somebody needs the answer other than you to the question you're going to ask. So uh, the uh, panel uh, can also can, of course, ask questions. You can use your audio only or you can do audio and visual video. So let's uh, get started, if we will, if we may, with the one and only Mel Mel. Go ahead and unmute. Good night, um, Robin. Good night, Lynn, Francis, and, Tay, and <laughs> Chris, and everybody else. Um, first of all, I want to say um, earlier today, before I joined the live, something in my spirit was asking me to pray. And I don't want anybody quoting that it's about church, it's about what's in your inside. And I went on the club and I put in um, a prayer for healing for everybody. It's funny that now, you all are talking about the people who are ill. So I just wanted to say there's a prayer that I just put out on the club before joining. It's funny. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. you very much. Very ironic that you would do that and not even knowing what's going on here exactly. with all the people. Thank so you. it's good stuff. It's much appreciated, uh, Mel Mel. Right. And I'm not holy, but it's just discernment. Um, number two, um, Francis. I, I also was trying to practice the go live before I came on to Roblin Live. I was doing a one-on-one -on -one just before the live after work. And um, <laughs> I think I was having a bit of difficulty knowing how what to do. So I know I missed out a little on your training because I was doing something again. So I'm hoping that, sorry, you go over a little. <laughs> Um, the part I didn't quite get is how I 
share it with the contacts? Do I have to have their email address? For example, Monday is a day that I'm holding a little training on, hands-on training. How do I disperse it to the contacts? The go live. If you are inviting, once you click go live, you are in the room. Huh? You are in the room, OK? okay. Then, then you go to the participant side to invite uh, people to come in. Uh, do you want me to share screen? Yes, please. Thank you very much. And Pat, I see your hand, so you're next on the price is right. Uh, maybe Rob continue first. I let me adjust the okay. Thank you. All right. Now, what I can say is, uh, as you already heard, Mel, I had an issue also with the go live, but that was uh, self induced on my part. I was, as I mentioned, uh, I entered my uh, R. Gorman uh, email, uh, which I use for, you know, personal stuff, has nothing to do with Aunt Bassett. And then I did not even, I didn't enter my alternate email and I didn't enter my O mail. Now, had I done any of that properly, uh, chances are it would have worked, you know, easily enough. So uh, uh, we're all learning and uh, tonight's a good night for us to be a hands-on group and, uh, and, and get some real good information. Uh, are you with us now, Francis? Yeah. Sorry, uh, Lynn, can you let me co-post again? Because I, re oh. I refresh. Oh, all right, sure. Let me find you. Oh, looking for you. Great tone, dude. Voice. I don't see you, Francis. Maybe I got to refresh. I see. Oh, you're an attendee, right? No, I'm uh, in the speaker room. Oh, okay. But not, yeah. I just pinned him. Okay. Not close. Oh, uh, the other device. I got the other device. Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't see you on the. Okay. Yeah. Lynn, he is below my picture. Oh, I think we're all it when we Yeah, we all have yeah. different views, so Okay. Oh, but okay. I see him there. I pinned you, uh, Francis, as well. Um I'm already in the room. <laughs> no. Yeah. Right. You're not appearing on the Auntie Lynn, you have to refresh your browser page uh, quickly. Okay. The, the others can continue talking. Yeah. No way. Rob, you are mute, muted. Rob, you are muted. Okay, is that any better? Hopefully. Yeah. That's when we refresh. We got. Yeah, when I, no, I didn't realize that when you refresh, you lose the video and the audio so just there's a little tidbit right there that um, i wouldn't 100 percent tune into i refresh but i don't see you francis can you refresh francis okay i refresh again okay, all right while francis is doing that let's go to pat see if i can uh, help out a little bit pat go ahead i was just wondering if um chris's and francis's training is going to be in the oes specific classroom because I'm still working on catching up on trainings. So I was just wondering if those this trainings tonight are going to be in the OES specific classroom. 
I yes, would I'm say. Gonna, go ahead. I'm gonna go. gonna reply that right away, Rob. So, uh, Pat, um, yes, of course, and all, anyway, this is already available uh, in the in this live stream publicly. So, and uh, but uh, portions of this, um, like uh, my first presentation, will be um, somehow trimmed. So it will be customized with that uh, topic. Then another uh, video would be for uh, Francis alone. So it will be on the ONET Club of uh, OES Classroom Training. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Back to you, Rob. Lin, can you see me? Okay, I just refreshed again because I didn't see you the last time I refreshed. Let me look one more time. No, what? Uh, why don't I make um, one of you, somebody a second host? Chris, do you want to be second host or? Yes, please. That's uh, that's what I'm also thinking. Uh, <laughs> Chris too. Yes, the the Chris uh, two. Yes, Chris two. Okay. Okay, now you can make Francis a co-host, please. Okay, I'm looking for him in the participant list, typing his name, F-R-A, in the okay. search oh, box. Oh, I see him now. He showed up now. I'll make, I'll make him a co-host. All, All right, right. the co-host okay. now. It just showed up. KT2. That's him. Okay. And Francis Tay. Uh, I think, oh. uh, Lynn, you, you made a wrong one, co host. Okay. I got to make KT Hugh a co host, right? No, no, no. Uh, Jojo7. Jojo7. Uh, Omil? Yeah, we don't see any Omil. So, what's your, your username here in the webinar? Okay, okay. I'm already co host now. Okay. Thank you. Okay. It's Please. KT Hugh. I'm yes, that's host. it. <laughs> Okay, that's not, it not, you, you make... beat me to the to okay, the punch I... uh, until in <laughs> so i'll you want me to remove the whole the co-host for francis k no, just no, no, leave it, leave it. don't okay. touch don't okay. okay all right thanks thank you thank all right are you ready francis yeah okay go ahead and this is an answer to uh mel mel's question i believe and pedro i got you on the list brother Okay, I, I go back to the to the screen just now uh, when we created the remember I, I created the go live then I I I came up from the room and go to the webinar. Now therefore I got two two uh, event created huh? uh, to follow up with what Mel is asking. I go to the conference conference button, okay? Create uh, go live. Okay? Some meeting rooms. Oh, it won't allow me to go in. Okay, let me go to create another. Can't wait to get back on the road. John, you're, you're unmuted. John Barilla. John, you're, we hear you're practicing oh, the song. <laughs> Don't forget to keep muted, John. Please. I'm not muted. The thing is, I'm muted. No, you weren't. We heard you singing. I, it must be on a different thing because I'm just muting mine on and off right now. So maybe I'm on here twice, perhaps. Maybe. Yeah, because okay, no. I, I didn't mean to do that. On the road again. 
Okay, Mel, do you see the screen? This is a go live uh, uh, procedure. Huh? Let's go and you don't have an attendee room. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, Francis. Okay, yeah, okay. You go to the, uh, this is a, what do you call it? The, the screen for for the host to see who is in the room. Huh? So it, you only have conference set up. So conference setup is only for speaker, no attendee room, no need. Huh? And for those who, for those of you, conference setting is only for hundred uh, co-hosts. Huh? Hundred, your maximum is hundred. Uh, so if you don't have an attendee, that means you only have capacity for hundred to come in. Okay. So once you click start, you just go in and click on the participant here. Okay, participant, and go to the top right hand corner here to click invite, right? So you, you either you you copy the event invitation and send it to your friend, or you can send send an invitation by email or by email, right? Uh, let, let's go to our email. Huh? This is an alternative email, it's not outsiders. If you are sending people who are not a user, then the, the, the additional step will be they need to register for OMIL to come in. Okay, once you have the email set up, you come down here and invite, okay? The invitation sent successfully. So in my email, right, you can see here, on passive technology means the system, the system will send out, okay? Right, dear user, they invited you as attendee. Urgent conference. So just just click join. I don't know where they can accept for third third conference room in the in the window. I just try here, right? Or he also have this uh, trim URL for attendee room, right? So either you can click here or click here. It's the same. Huh? Click join now. Right, see? So if if the invite the person you, you invite is not a OES user, then this will become it will look like this. Okay. If you send him uh, send your, your friend or your customer uh, the invite link. When he click join now, it will it will appear like this. I mean he need to register uh OMIL account. But if he is a he is in your group or in your network. You want to invite them to come in. Then when they click join now, it will require them to fill in the email ID and to come in. Okay. Is that, is that what you want, Mel? Francis, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. So, so to end it, um, if I'm having the O-Connect on Monday, I don't need to do that right now because I've already sent the link. But I can practice with that same concept. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Thank you. You can you can give them the you can practice the same same process. Thank right. you. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Remember our our product everything is by permission. They come in here not by someone push them to come in. They come in here registered by permission. They okay. they give you permission. I appreciate the the, the help. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you uh, to uh, you, Mel, for the question. Very good one. And uh, thank you, Francis. I'm glad you're now a co-host. That makes life a little easier. And Armin is coming in. Armin Hoag. All right. And I believe Srijit has come in. Yes. Srijit as well. Welcome, welcome, welcome. 
And uh, I think we're going to go. Pedro, uh, it looks like your hand went down. Are you still here? Yeah, I am still here. Thank you. Go ahead. Ask your question or make your comment. We'd love to hear from you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> I came just recently. Uh, I was out uh, attending a gathering, but uh, the, uh, the question that Mel asked was one that I had asked myself today after I listened that uh, the new, there was a new vote on No on Connect about uh, uh, this uh, sort of uh, short notice uh, uh, action that that Connect has. Uh, go live so uh, basically that's what uh, francis was answering but I, I just want to reassure myself uh, am i correct that you can invite anyone whether they are already registered or not uh, maybe you have sent them a text uh, as a as an invitation i'm going to send you a link so we can get together i can I want to show you uh, some of the features that uh, Oconnect has or whatever, and then send, then open a webinar, correct? A new webinar. And from there is where you would start uh, uh, the uh, uh, go live option. Uh, that is my question. No, no, uh, the go live uh, option is for if you are already live in the webinar, right? You already live in the webinar, and you you will think of your friend, so you go to the participant uh, side to to invite to invite your friend. Because you are in already, right? You just want to invite your friend to come in to join you. Yeah? Okay, okay, yeah, I understand. Thank you. So that means that you have opened a webinar already. You're running a webinar. And you think of a friend, somebody who you would like to bring in, whether he's registered or not. Am I correct? Yeah, uh, yeah, correct. Yeah, because this uh, this uh, option will give him the the option to register at that time, and yeah. he will come into my organization. Right. Okay. The system is automatic. If he if he's not a user, the system will once once he click join now, it will pop up. Registration page. Right. You will pop up register, not, not the login page, registration page. I see. But thank you. That, that and one, once he register, he will become your network. He will, will come in as your network. Correct. So you will he will be able to join the, the live meeting that is going on and, yeah, and he will be part of my organization. Okay, yeah. thank you. Thank you. Uh, appreciate it, uh, Francis. Thank you, Rob. Ah, thank you. Great question, Pedro, and a good answer as well, Francis. Uh, uh, next up will be Miss Carmela Schwartz, the uh, Israeli Rose girl. Go ahead, Israeli Rose. Hi, everybody. Uh, I want to ask, uh, we are live, live streaming you, you, from All Connect to YouTube. And at the same time, we can live streaming to LinkedIn and to Facebook. Correct. So we have to go all the, all the way in Facebook to do the same as we do in OConnect. Because I never uh, live stream in oh, Facebook, it's something else. Chris, could you explain that? Or in LinkedIn, for example. Yeah. Chris so is how we do that? Go ahead, Chris. Yeah, currently, currently, we, we, uh, the system uh, allows us to, to, oh, to one stream. Second. It's hard yeah. to understand you. Uh, can you mute, Carmela? For a while, I'm going to mute the, the, the devices okay. I have here. Just hello, mute hello. temporarily, Carmela, while you listen. Thank you. Okay, so in answer to in in answering the question of carmela uh, we are all currently we are allowed to live stream to youtube uh, yeah youtube and but facebook will be coming 
soon. It's already in the in the OConnect manual. It is written there. The way we are able to to live stream in different destinations like LinkedIn is through a a third party app uh, through Restream. So that's the special way we we can do that. It's a third party app. Okay. So that's it. Thank you very much. Go ahead. Thank you but for it's your answer. Soon, no connect. It'll be coming soon. No connect. Right now, it's through a third party. Is that okay, Carmela? Just, is that clear enough, Carmela? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Grace, for your answering uh, i believe soon it will come and uh, we can do live streaming to the other uh, media too right you are carmela thank you let's go to greg hill in the san juan islands greg bring it brother good evening everybody <clears throat> say um this question is for francis um it's an easy one you probably know it <laughs> On the, go, on the go live, do we have a copy in our, our O trim that's been made that's there also, like on the regular webinar? There's a copy yeah. of that. Link. Is, yeah. there is? Uh, uh, when you click go live, a okay. copy of the link will also send to your O trim account. Okay, that's what I was wondering. Thank you. Yeah, that's and uh, congratulations, Greg. Your Oh yes, hashtag oh yes classroom. You will now you have five posts in that oh, page. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. I wanted to get on your <coughs> stuff, but it's so darn early I can't get up right now <laughs> recently early like that. Yeah, very soon you will occupy the whole page. <laughs> you do excellent, Greg. I see you. Uh, you do excellent LinkedIn and you are in the oh yes classroom on top. Oh. You are wonderful. You don't need it. Well, I have, hey, to, this is not, I have to think that this is a, not the problem. I have to give that uh, thank you to uh, Mr. Tay for teaching me those little tricks and stuff. And uh, I did write a, a pretty big art, a thing today about uh, this uh, hashtag business that's been going on. And one of the things I noticed is there's a lot of people on, in, on LinkedIn, they're just putting in hashtags, they're not putting anything else. And myself, I wrote an article basically saying, don't just put in hashtags. Put some content in there because it's really not a lot of fun just to see hashtags. And I want to see some content coming in there, not just hashtags, hashtags, everybody's hashtagging. So what I think is smart is to add some content because the AI or the spiders or the bots, they're going to pick these things up a lot quicker, I believe, than they're going to pick up just a hashtag. And I'm hoping I'm not overstepping my bounds on that. I love well you. Well done. Thank you. All right. Uh, I guess that means there's been a handoff to me. Let's uh, go back to Pat Green. Come on, Dorothy, bring it. Hello, everybody. Love you all. Um, Francis, I don't know if you heard my question to begin with. Is your training also going to be in um, OES Classroom, the training you gave us today? Uh, we'll do, we'll do. I, I, I will do next week, next Tuesday. Thank you. Okay. Also, um, Greg, I agree with you. If I want to open up something, I want more than just a bunch of hashtags. I want some information. <laughs> I understand what you're saying. <laughs> anyway, that's all I had to say. <laughs> all right. That sounds like hashtag Pat Green to me. All right. Thank you, Pat. Appreciate your question. And uh, let's uh, let's uh, scroll around a little bit and let me see if anyone else has a question. If you think it's not important, don't think that. Any question and all questions, if they mean something to you, they mean something to us. So, and to Francis, and of course to uh, Sifu Chris. So, uh, just bring the questions. We're we're happy. We'll stay as long as you guys have questions tonight, because we want uh, no stone on. 
turned. We want all stones turned so we can uh, all learn. Oh, all, turn, all stones turn so we can all learn. I don't like it. All right. Let's see what we got here. I see we have a hand from Mel. Go ahead, Mel, please. Thank you. As it came to mind um, tonight, I noticed on the screen, I don't know if I was those enough. I'm not sure. But free, um, free events were <laughs> created tonight by me. I think by accident, two of them were in default, so I end up practicing, like I said, one on one with one and the other one for Monday. But there's another one that was created for the same day, which is today. So, Francis, my question is um, I know there's a way to delete, but if we delete, um, would the back of the back end, meaning the text, pick that up and see that we are just um, loitering? No, no. Asking. They only need to know your your uh, reason for delete. There's no delete sign. Oh. It's cancel. Right? The word is cancel. The three three dot there is cancel. Once you cancel, they pop up. Ask you why do you want to cancel? You just just say that your hand is itchy. It's okay. You know? <laughs> just, uh, yeah, sticky just, fingers. Just put one answer there. You know, that's all. Okay. They, they won't they won't blacklist you. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that being said, let me scroll around a little bit and uh, see if anybody else has questions. Come on, just bring them. Uh, we've got the two Sifus here. Let's go to Carmela Schwartz. And his, I see your hand, Carmela. Go ahead. I wanted to say I did the FLU session today, also three articles. <laughs> And I put them in our net. First in our net and then in Facebook. Now I have to copy them to LinkedIn. <laughs> All right. Sounds so, like I'm 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 it, the 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 important thing is not just to come and listen to you, it's the it's the practice. So today I told myself you must practice. If you don't practice while you come here, you lose you lose you lose the time. Time of Francis and you lose the time of yourself. So go and do it. If so you if you don't use it, you lose it. So that's good. You're practicing, uh, Carmela. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. And we have been preaching consistency. So be consistent, whether it be uh, hashtags or whether it be keywords or whether it be your whether it be your posts and O net. And as Francis and Chris and Lynn have said. As some of you have said, posting an O-Net uh, and putting the hashtags there gets it out into the Internet world now. And that's where we need to be with O-Net. So keep up the good work. Uh, it's working. It is working. And before we even uh, have the commercial version of O-Connect, I, I think people are learning more and more and more about on passive. Good stuff all the way around. Do. Let's uh, do a little scrolling and the participants and see if there's any other questions. Please don't be shy. Is there anyone else looking to come in? No, but we can take a peek at the chat and see what's going I on. I think we're going to go to the chat. Here we go. Yeah, see if anybody's, you know, they want to participate. All right, Lynn's going to check the uh, chat, the O-Connect chat. Wait a minute, we have a question while she's doing that. And that's... Uh, David, did you have a question or was that an inadvertent hand? Go ahead, David. Switch it. Yeah, I, I kind of got a question to ask since we're asking a lot of questions here tonight. Um, you know, I know a lot about on pass, but the problem with me is I'm kind of a slow learner on that kind of stuff. And and I just kind of like to know how is that going to work for somebody like me, you know, that doesn't catch on as stuff as fast as other people do. Well, we're going to continue with what we do, uh, you know, with the training here and, and answering questions, which should help. Uh, I'm willing to do one-on-ones with uh, not just you, but anyone. I, I did a one-on-one -on -one today uh, that I'm going to mention to Chris that I need a little help on uh, that I did today. Uh, but uh, you can contact us and we'll either help you ourselves if we can. 
And if not, we'll hook you up with the right people that can. Because uh, we're here for the masses, so to speak. You know, we want everybody to know what we know. Not that we're on top of the world with knowing things, but we know a little more than the average person, and we're happy to share that. So yeah. uh, yeah. if you want direct help yeah, from the, me, I, you know, yeah. you can certainly contact me. Yeah. Well, the thing is, I, you know, I... I've known pastors five years. I've, I've done a lot with on pass and everything, but I know me and I know I have a little bit of a learning problem and I've had that all my life. So there's nothing I can do about that, but I want to be able to do just as good as anybody else yeah. in on pass. And so, but uh, you know, that's what I'm worried about a little bit, you know, that's going to kind of slow me down a lot. You know what I'm saying? I do know what you're saying, but uh, remember what Ash has said. No one's going to be left behind in any way. So I believe I believe there will be additional training uh, coming from corporate. I don't know when, uh, so I don't want to hesitate. You know, I don't want to hazard a guess. But uh, as I said, uh, I'm willing to help you and, and anyone else that needs uh, one on one help uh, time permitting. And uh, I'll answer any questions I can. Uh, as well as Lynn has done that as well. And uh, we have helped a number of people uh, that felt the same way you did, that it was, you know, a little too much and, and it really needs some one-on-one. -on -one. So yeah. uh, feel free to contact me uh, or, or Lynn. I'm happy to help you, David, any way I can. Yeah. And here comes Francis Tay. Go ahead, Francis. Oh, go ahead, Francis. Yeah, yeah David, I... I... I see you joining a lot of the webinar from other other group and our group here. Uh, to be able to log into the webinar, you are already far, far ahead of many of us, many people, right? So this is already technically you are there. Uh, so the other advice I will give you is copycat. Huh? Copy the video. Below the video, there is a share, no? share button. Click the share. Mm -hmm the share and then you just post it in any of the of your uh your group huh? whether is it facebook or onet just put your um, uh otrim.co that the link your website link just put that and that's rest huh? that's right okay. ready to recreate again All right thank you mm -hmm. yeah right and then david we have the oes classroom uh club and the club is located in Onet. Are you a member of the club yet? Uh, not yet. I don't think so. I've been. Okay. What time is that? Uh, it's a club. What time is that? It's, no, a, it's club. a library. It's a library. And it's, it's where we put all the recordings of the OES training. Oh, okay. Okay. And that's kind of good because you can just watch it. Nobody's with you but yourself, and you can repeat and, you know, do the steps. Yeah. And at your pace, and we highly recommend the club. Just go to ONET, and in the share area, when you click, click on clubs, there's a sh uh, search button, sorry, a search button, and you type in OES Classroom, and the club will show up, and just ask to be a member. Say that you want okay. to join, there's a button to join, and then one of the admins will accept you, and you'll see what I mean, all the different um yeah i yeah, don't yeah don't get me wrong i i listen i listen on pass all the time even when i go for walks i i go for walks and stuff and i'm always listening on pass it all the time you know get updates and all that stuff but you know for me having a little bit of a slow learning problem i kind of worry about myself a little bit if i'm going to be able to keep up with everybody else you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. and uh, i worry about that a little bit so well, as Francis said, and I'll just reiterate, it's your way ahead of uh, literally tens of thousands because every day, uh, Lynn and I get a question on, well, how do I log on? Wait a minute. Where have you been for the last? <laughs> Boy, and this is people yeah. that have been around five and a half years. Where do I log on? Yeah. So don't feel at all that you're behind uh, the eight ball or behind anything. You're on top of your game, David, and we'll help you any way we can as well. Next, let's go to Greg Hill. Greg, see your hand up, brother. Bring it. Thank you. Uh, I just wanted to... I just wanted to add that, you know, we talk about uh, helping one helps us all, and that's for darn sure. So one of the things I want to just add with here and with David is 
Oh, today I got a call from Franz Marcio, Marcillon, a nice guy, and I like to connect with people. And I just wanted to let you know, that David, that I am here as well. Sometimes when we, we're all so darn busy, and if you can't get a hold of somebody, then you can get a hold of me. I'll do my best if I can. So I just want to let you know it's about support and supporting other people as well. So I'm here. I'm a slow learner as well. I'm, you know, I always have been. It's only because I hate reading. <laughs> I never I never used to like to read, but uh, I do now. And I never liked English, but I do now. <laughs> I, so anyway, David, I'm here for you. I just wanted you to know that. And uh, I wanted also, if uh, France, France was uh, listening, say I'm glad to see you here this evening. Thank you. And thanks, David, so much for being here. I'm here to help. Arigato. Arigato. Arigato gozaimasu. <laughs> You're amazing, Greg. Oh, yeah, do it shit. Oy Here we go. <laughs> All right, before I get, uh, before my Japanese goes off the track here and I, I can't get by Arigato, let's see who else may want to say something or ask a question. Uh, come on now, bring it. Uh, you know, David brought his question, very good one. And, uh, you know, Greg, that's very true. I, I want to reiterate again. Uh, not to sound like a broken record, but helping one does help us all. Because there's that one thing, like tonight, I picked up on what I did when we were doing this practice, go live. I didn't even put the right email in. Now, wait a minute, I've been around five years plus, and I can't put the right email in to get the link? Come on, Robert. So it does happen. And uh, uh could be the Alka-Seltzer had worn off, I don't know. But... Uh, <laughs> And we're all here to help each other, and that's good stuff. And uh, it's good to see uh, this is a family. Uh, we pray for each other when we can, and it's needed. We uh, we take phone calls. I, I know many of you have taken our calls. We've taken yours. And uh, that's what we do. That's what this is about. Ash has said uh, we are a family. Yeah, we're a movement. We're a huge movement, a million four hundred thousand worth. And uh, the more of the more uh, the one hundred one million four hundred thousand we can get active, that's why you hear from me every night without fail, migrate without hesitation, migration without hesitation. There are literally now this is a fact, tens of thousands who haven't migrated. Now wait a minute, if you're going to pay ninety seven dollars, okay, you got it back, and you have have not migrated over. But to the OES, you're missing things, and there's no reason to miss a thing. So you're going to keep hearing, everyone's going to keep hearing me. That's going to be one of my top things. Please migrate. Don't hesitate. And if you need help, anyone needs help migrating, uh, whether it's Greg or Sifu Francis or Sifu Chris or Carmela or Mel, John Barilla, who's helped a lot of people, you know, that's what we're here for. You know, this is uh, not a game. This is a business, and it's our businesses, and we need to help each other. And it's good to hear from Greg, and good to hear from everybody about that, because helping one does help us all. Can I'm, I say one, one more thing, Rob? Yeah. You can say yeah. two. Go ahead. <laughs> I don't know. That's going to cost me five bucks. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, what I wanted to say was I wanted to thank Pedro uh, tonight for bringing up an issue that he wasn't real sure about. And I think that was a great question, seriously, a great question, because I don't think a lot of people realize that that feature, Go Live, was something that we could use while we're actually live already. And that one person, for sure, was me. I didn't understand that. I had, I'm just learning about the Go Live after yesterday popped us on it, or pop, popped it on us. <laughs> so that was a wonderful question, especially for me, trying to figure out, so the Go Live is what? Uh, suddenly I can just go live and, and ask people to come and join. No, I see now what happens here. That's a, and it's a great feature, actually, uh, especially for you if you're trying to build your base. But thank you, uh, Pedro, and thank you for joining that, Mr. Seafood. <laughs> Mr. Seafood. You, you, also, you also give an uh, opportunity for people who, who have uh, difficulty uh, to find a link. Huh? Mm -hmm. you get to find a link and now you click go live you are in you know you're in already right. that's a good point 
Yes, thank you. All right, uh, ball's back in my court. Let's see. I know some of you have questions you're just not asking, so uh, don't make me do it. Don't make me do it. Come on now, if you've got a question, if you've got a comment, bring the comment up because comments answer questions as well. Uh, you know, you may say something that somebody's been wondering. Uh, I know that happens all the time with uh, uh, Francis and Chris and, and myself and Lynn. We'll be talking about something and there comes the answer and didn't even ask the question. So we know it happens and it's good. It's good we're all on the same uh uh, I don't want to use the word team, but I'll use the word team. We're in the same movement, I should say. So, and uh, let's see. There goes Mel again. Before we go to Mel, uh, uh, DL, I just wanted to say to you, uh, Lynn decided she was going to check out blockchain today. So thanks for rubbing off on her. Uh, and so she and I have another subject we can talk about now. And that's the blockchain. So appreciate you bringing it up as often as you have. Thank yeah, you. absolutely. You're going to find it's going to be amazing stuff. I'll tell you what, uh, it's amazing. I, everything's going that way, too. So back to you, Rob. Yeah, and I wanted to just say kudos to an Indian team. It's called Unpassive Team In It to Win It. And I try to um, just listen in on their sessions. They have daily sessions. And they have really, really good content, good content and high value. And today's presentation was by Swaru, uh, who presented blockchain technology. And I was grateful because the slides were in English. So although they were speaking Hindi, I was able to pick up the information. And it was pre presented really, really well. So, um, you know, I encourage folks just to go to various webinars where you feel comfortable and where you find value and just keep learning. It's all about lifelong learning and it's only going to benefit you and and benefits everybody the more we all learn the more we benefit the company and Ashmafar as well thanks thank you miss nakamoto uh, uh mel was next and then we'll come back to uh dl and dawn go ahead mel please thank you rob um chris johnson once told me because <laughs> i used to reach out to him quite a bit in the beginning I have to call out on him because he once told me, Mel, it's there for everyone. I want to see you on a platform. I want to see you do something. Are you doing something? So I said, what do you mean? I be in my throat. I said, what do you mean? I'm attending the lives. But he said, I want to see you do more. Come out and shine because that's what we are in Unpassive. I, I don't know everything at all. I, ha I know nothing really. The little that I know, as Greg said, and maybe um, John or whoever is there that um, helps Carmela, we're just passing on the little things that we learn, the little knowledge, knowledge that we get from Francis, Chris, even Rob and Lynn, when we share with each other on the live, because we are all here, we have different styles of learning. David Switzer left the screen, but I wanted to um, give him a little bit of encouragement. Um, nobody knows it all. None of us knows it, know it all. We are, it's a new thing. We are all learning. And as um, Ash said, again, we are holding each other's hands to reach to the top. So nobody is going to be left behind. No stone is going to be left unturned. And um, David, you, you may be hearing me in the background, but I just want to let you know, um, don't feel that you have a little bit of disability in learning. We all have a disability. I didn't know that until I learned that in a program. We all, for some reason, have a way of um, disabled learning. So that's what we are here for, to help each other, to hold each other by the hand and just move on. And thanks to Francis and Chris, because I learned so much from you guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Mel. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's swing over to Dawn and DL. And then we'll go to Pedro. Go ahead, Don and DL. Yeah, thanks, Rob. I just wanted to uh, echo what uh, Melanie and Greg Hill uh, said about uh, being left behind. I've been in this business about five and a half years myself. So uh, David Switzer needs any kind of help whatsoever. I'll be glad to back up uh, Greg Hill on that as well. So uh, you can always contact me at any time. 
Uh, but the um, also pray for my friend Capil. I'm kind of concerned about him. I haven't seen him uh, in, a, in a week or two. He, he's my chess buddy. Uh, the game of chess actually originated in India in year 600, so I know the Indians know how to play chess. But uh, I'm just praying for his uh, health as well. <laughs> and uh, But uh, I have a question or two to ask, but I'm going to ask it on the Blockchain Heroes webinar tomorrow, uh, Lynn. So, uh, and, and I think it's a darn good question. I'm just kind of curious, but uh, uh, it's mainly a blockchain question. And that's what I'm uh, training for now. I'm going to be a developer. I'm not just going to learn blockchain. I'm going to be. I'm going to, I'm going to be writing the code. So, um, okay, Rob, back to you, Rob. All right, thanks uh, for that, wow. DL. Cool. And uh, let's see. Uh, next, we'll go to if we could. Let's go to Pedro. Back to you, Pedro. Uh, thank you, thank you, uh, Rob. Uh, I just wanted to make a comment uh, about. Uh, how important uh, it is to attend webinars. Uh, we listen a lot of things that we listen uh, repeatedly, but uh, sometimes uh, the ones uh, like Marty brings out points that I, I didn't understand on the positive. I know we're going to own it, uh, but I just didn't uh, didn't fully comprehend until something, a comment that he made. Uh, and he explained that uh, what uh, Mr. Mufara has done is replicating what he created. Uh, he wants every one of us to have a business. And uh, by, uh, by us uh, posting, everybody, all the ones, the early birds posting and and uh, sharing the link, and they say, oh, connect. Let's take one product, or oh, connect. If somebody is looking for a video conferencing and they will uh, ask in, in a searching engine, let's say Google, they say, okay, video conferencing. So the, the full list of all those offering that product will pop. Can you imagine, uh, let's say if a million people have posted something on o Connect, you know, with your link and whatnot, you will pop up. It will cover a full space, pages and pages and pages. So that is the way we're going to own it because we're going to own this space because the product is, is superior. And we, we have reasons to, to post and, and to offer this because it's superior in so many ways. And it's not just this, there, there are more products coming, but uh, I'm talking just one, the one that we have right now. So when we are posting that stuff with our own domain, it's gonna pop first page on any searching engine because there are there are a million people offering this product and that's how we're going to own on it <laughs> uh, the internet so to speak uh, something that I, I didn't fully understand until I you know it, it's just like that sometimes you uh, you you think that you have comprehended but uh, these fine points, until you listen and, uh, and you meditate on it, how it's going to happen, um, that is possible. If everybody's posting and we cover in a full space, we are owning the space of the internet. So we are, we are uh, on, on it. <laughs> uh, just wanted to share that. Thank you. Thank you, Pedro. I, I agree with you 100%. And uh, as I've mentioned a few times now, uh, when Ash drew that big circle on the uh, whiteboard when the presentation board first came out, uh, he, he and I were talking directly, and he, he drew the little circle with IT in it, if you guys recall, any of you, and that was for Internet Technology, IT. And then he drew the big circle, and that was for IT which uh, on passive is going to own and I, I don't think there's any question about it now 
Uh, the more we see with O-Connect, we know what's coming with O-Domain, O-Verify, uh, O-Cademy. Uh, the sky is uh, truly going to be the limit. And, you know, it may have been a trite phrase uh, way back when, when he said that we're, we're going to go to another new top. I think every day we go to another new top because every day there's some some enhancement to everything or there's something new, uh, you know, that comes along uh, that we'll be able to use. So to me, it's ex it's a, it is exciting times now. Uh, you know, a lot of us, you know, are ready to start receiving apples. That's a good thing. But on the other <laughs> hand, uh, we're going right to another new top every day, as I mentioned, and. Uh, it's good stuff. I, I've never been around this many people focused on one goal, and that's to uplift humanity. I've, I've never, ever in my life, and I've been involved in charity organizations, uh, the VA uh, I've been involved with, helping uh, homeless vets, etc. cetera. Uh, I've never seen anything like this. So we're, you know, uh, as Oliver Fonte says, and I'll say it again, so I'm blue in the face. We are fine. Hashtag we are fine. Hashtag Oliver Fonte. That all being said, all right, who's next? I don't know who my manager is with the resounds, but thanks. You're doing a good job. <laughs> Hi, Chris. Thanks. <laughs> no need, though. If it's me, yeah, you don't have to do a resound. <laughs> I'm all right without the resound, I think, but I appreciate it. All right, here we go to Mel. Thank you. I don't want to act like I know everything, and I don't. Again, <laughs> sorry. But um, has anybody checked um, on passive in Chat GPT for or Chat GPT? Anybody well, has said anything about on passive in Chat GPT? Personally, I'm in chat GPT. I was doing nothing but chat GPT, but now I'm in this uh, uh, perplexity and Claude and on passive is all over those. There is, you can, you punch in on passive and it gives you a description of on passive. If you, if you punch in oh verify, there's a description of that. If you punch in other things about on passive, there's a description of that. It's getting there. And it's yes. getting there quickly, very yeah. quickly. But ChatGBT is still living in the, the dark ages of 2022, to be honest. No, well, I was going to say, um, Rob, I'm going to take it back. Because when you put in on passive in ChatGPT, it does come up. Maybe not all the products, but I've um, researched something in on passive about three times. And it does give you a nice write up about on passive. So, we are being recognized, our company is being recognized. I know it's an AI based company and ChatGPT is AI based. However, if people are saying that um, on passive is not yet known, if ChatGPT knows it, then it's going somewhere. You know, right. it's picking up the vibes. Well, um, I honestly switched, you know, from ChatGPT to get uh, more current stuff, but I'll, hey, I'll go back to ChatGPT tomorrow and and check yeah. it all out because I try, yeah. we try, uh, Lynn and I both try to stay up on the most current stuff that's being said uh, about us and to us. So uh, I'll be checking chat TPT tonight, likely before uh, night, night time. Yes. So thank Just you. Thank put you. Put it on passive, but it won't give you about O verify. It tells you it's O verify or the other O's are not yet in tune, but on passive itself, it gives you a nice spiel about on passive. Good stuff. I'm, yeah. I'm on it. I'll be printing that out tonight. Uh, yes, Greg, go ahead, sir. Thank you. I've never been to chat GPT yet. Um, who can tell me what's the best thing about chat GPT? Well, I... <laughs> I've used it quite a bit in the last number of months, uh, and I know Francis has and uh, Chris had. The absolute best thing is it's AI infused. And uh, as uh, as uh, uh, Mel just mentioned, we're now appearing there as on passive. So there's a free version. That's all I use is the free version. I know you can pay and upgrade and do this and do that, 
but for right now, I'm a uh, I'm a freebie kind of guy. And uh, uh, Chat GPT and Perplexity and Claude, and I think there's a, a Microsoft one as well. They're all very very good about providing. If you have a subject matter you want to learn about, even if it's not on passive, let's say you want to learn something about neurosurgery because your friend's having surgery tomorrow, it'll give you a complete breakdown of what all is about, you know, what neurosurgery is all about, just as an example. So that's I thought me, it was just, I point. thought it was just sorry, just let me interrupt you a second. I thought it was just for rewriting content. No, I didn't know it was a search engine as well. It's a search engine as well, and it will. You can rewrite content there as well. Yeah. Okay. okay. In fact, sometimes when I'm doing my uh, truth be known now, I'm going to be <laughs> transparent. Some of the things that I say after I've researched them, either there or somewhere else on the Internet, I'll have perplexity or chat GPT write what I'm going to say, and I'll take the best of what they have to say and use it. I'll be perfectly honest. So... If I sound smart sometimes, which I don't think I do often, uh, that's where it comes from, the AI. So I'm a proponent and a believer in AI, big time, big time. Which is good. Um, so maybe, Rob, because you have not um, seen um, on Passive, I paid for it. <laughs> it's $53 for the year, I think it is. And maybe the paid version is kind of premium, so you get more options, you get more and now it's incorporated with two other um, chats. I forgot the names, but it keeps asking me, do you want to have all three to better um, able to bring to make you shine or something like that? But I well, I'll check. I'll check it out. Fifty three for a year is only uh, what four dollars and change a month. So yeah. I'll check it out. Uh, you know, and when we can afford it, maybe we'll just get it. Yeah. But we've been so far with the free version of perplexity claude and chat gpt they're yeah. all chat gpt i think is with the per paid version they're probably upgrading past 2022 that's what it sounds like and uh, the others are already current and uh they'll all say they all give you a disclaimer as of today this is what we know and they'll if they don't say it in that term do it and they'll, you know, I, I've gotten three and four pages when I've researched the top of these search engines is at the bottom, it will ask, and if that wasn't enough here, at this three or four or five other places to click on, which is pretty good stuff, I think. Well, thank you. Thank you, Mama. Yeah, it'll help you, Greg. Check it out. Thank and you. it's the four. There's second. I think there's number three. Can yeah, I say something about ChatGPT? Yeah, the third one. Go ahead, Francis. Yeah. ChatGPT is a <clears throat> is a storage. Huh? Actually, the ChatGPT can be can be referred to a blockchain, but it's a storage of uh, knowledge of info uh, in in. Uh, those engineers, scientists, everybody uh, initially were trying to input uh, uh, to create a, a human machine, you know, uh, and it turned out to be it turned out to be a generative generative uh, AI of the past of what is uh, input into the storage. Right? So, if your question is uh, something related to what they have, ChatGPT can answer you. Right. Mm -hmm. And because it ended, the, the information ended on, 20, uh, on the 2022, two, two, so any information after that uh, is not inside there. On mm -hmm. passive is part of a uh, chat GPT because on passive started in 2018. But all connect, the first tools of on, uh, on passive was not storage. Right. So if you ask chat GPT about on passive, they can answer you. Uh, today, right, but not in the form that uh, chat uh, all connect is what you know. They they would they will use this word seems like you know, when the chat GPT doesn't like uh, doesn't know the answer. It seems like this is what this is what. So that means to say uh, because it's a generative one, they would uh, conversation. Huh? So now you ask me something, 
the human being will say, I think it's about about this, you know, I think. So chat GPT behave like human. Seems like, you know, he's telling you. It's, it's very good. Right? So now the 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 improved version of chat GPT is browser based. Browser. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's a current current uh, uh, conversion. You ask chat GPT, they will pull up from all the information on the internet, uh, which mm -hmm. is a uh, chat GPT version 4 or chat GPT plus uh, the new the new one that's coming in in that that uh, Kamel, uh, camera has uh, tested is you put an image into chat GPT uh, based on the image chat GPT can generate to you all the article on it, give you a content based on image which wow. is mind-blowing you know mm -hmm. it, it's mind-blowing you know even what it say to you is that what is embedded in this uh, so-called Sora, uh, the image recognition, is a, is a, also a face recognition. So they can put a picture into the chat GPT and the police can tell where are you, where is the background, where you live, what's your birthday, mm -hmm. who, is a, who is a neighbor, who is your, your relative. All the information from the internet, they will pull it out. You know? So this is very... Interesting, but very scary. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, while we're at that, uh, and while you were talking, Francis, I was listening, and Mel, uh, and Greg, uh, I did uh, go to ChatGPT, and on passive is listed in the free version as well. Yeah, it is. Yeah. But OConnect is not. <laughs> OConnect is not. That is correct. <laughs> but on passive, as you mentioned, Francis, starting in eighteen, uh, there's been enough you know, inquiries about it where they finally, I guess, had to say something and do. And it doesn't say anything negative, I might add. There are places where you may read something negative, not with chat GPT, also not with uh, perplexity and Claude. So it's good stuff. I think we're getting somewhere in a big way. Uh, it may not seem like it to us because we're all waiting in anticipation, but uh, we're getting out there. There's no doubt about it. My all I know is if because um, all I know for myself, and I don't know for anybody else, and I'm pretty sure there's other people who will agree. From the time I started on passive, and from the time Ocon, um, I mean the life, how you call it, the the platform we have. Since then, I have learned so much, and um, in small ways, in big ways, and I am proud of what I've learned, and I'm proud of where I'm going. You know, and um, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. Like Kamel always said, we are in university. <laughs> yeah, still undergraduate, but yeah, I'm learning. Thank you. All righty, thank you, Mel. Yes, it is very interesting, as a matter of fact. All right, before we come back to you, uh, DL and Dawn, uh, I'm not sure if Diana has to leave or not, but Diana, go ahead. Uh yeah, thank you, sir. Uh, give me a chance for saying something. I, I have a question uh, about ChatGPT. You are uh, talking about it. In the meantime, I am charging in my uh, mobile app store. Uh, there are many uh, kind of uh, ChatGPT. Which one uh, real original, sir? If possible, you can give me a, a real ChatGPT link. Openai.com. Sorry, uh, Open, openai.com. Oh, openai.com. Thank you. I, 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 right now I'm charging that. Thank you. Sorry, interrupt to Rob sir. Not a problem at all. Thanks for uh, asking that. Of C through Francis. Let's go back to DL and Dong. I was just going to answer uh, Greg's original question about what's the best thing about it. Uh, chat GPT, and in my opinion, it's the automation, obviously. But, uh, and again, I, I do some research on these kind of things, but uh, in my mind, uh, you know, chat GPT is not an end to, to all. I mean, it's kind of got a, uh, you got to take it with a grain of salt, in other words. So uh, just just do your own uh, thinking on, on these things. So back to you, Rob. All right. Thank you. I've uh, obviously clicked the wrong button here. 
I got to go back to actual size. There we are. Okay. I hey, I'm I'm learning. I'm learning. If, if, uh, you, if you ask ChatGPT, uh, I think I, I did prompt ChatGPT one one time many many time uh, many days ago. I asked ChatGPT, uh, "What is ChatGPT?" And he replied, "Oh, you refer to me." <laughs> Machine he, learning is best. He referred to me. <laughs> you know, it's very That's human. Cool. You know, very human. Yeah, it's humanized. There's no doubt about it. Let's go uh, to Carmel. I see your hand. I do. I do. Go ahead, Carmela. Hi, everyone. I want to ask Francis. I started to play with the object, and I love it. And. Uh, I see there are clubs, but there are not so many clubs. I didn't open club myself because when you open club, you have to, you have to be a, a responsible to go every day to put something to make it interesting. Otherwise, why you have a club? And the, and there are not so many clubs. How I can find that the clubs to be joined to? You can you can search the bar on top, uh, search the bar from A to Z. Uh, you start with A, then C, then start with B. It's a lot. Uh, you have a QR QR code card by by Rob. Also, you have a Rob Dim Light Club, uh, and someone have a like if you don't eat, you will die club. It also have. Uh, right. You got okay. uh, Sharon Wheaton has Wheaton My Garden. Club and the serious club in the in the old net. Yeah. That's what I wanted to say, because I didn't find other clubs. Yeah. Serious please, as you. Please, uh, ever, I mean, please promote your club. If you have a club, you want people to join. You must promote the club, you know, so that like-minded people will come and join you, and uh, you know, have a coffee with you, right? Like, like. So put the link that the uh, people they want to come can yeah, get like it. Yeah, like DL, DL mentioned about the blockchain. You know, maybe you know, you create a club, and you know, people who want to. This club of blockchain will be in the club. You have, you have a DL club of blockchain. I would like to join it. Please send us a link. I would like to learn about the blockchain. It's very interesting. Yeah, it seems to be the way things are going with blockchain. So it looks like Onaloni, come on down. We'd love to hear from you, uh, Loni. Um, hi, Francis. I wanted to ask, what do you think about the... Um, the meta AI on um, um, WhatsApp, is it as good as the um, chat GPT? Meta AI is, is a live, uh, live, uh, I mean, live AI. Uh. Yeah. Uh, well, chat GPT, if you want a free one, there's a limit there, info limit. But if you want to like now subscribe to the, I don't know, is it version, version four or, or the plus, uh, you can just subscribe. Fifty dollars or fifty plus per year, it's good. Yeah? Uh, there are now since ChatGPT came out, there are a lot of competition. A lot of the company also want to be part of it. Uh, even Canva, Canva also ha uh, have have ChatGPT. Uh, you can put your your request, your prompt, what what image you want, what design you want in Canva, Canva ChatGPT, and they also give you a, the image, give you the design. So. Uh, it's overcrowded. Uh, it's too, it's too, uh, what do call it? You, 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 you cannot learn uh, enough. Okay, so just stick to one. If you want to do ChatGPT uh, four, just stick to one. If you're familiar, but practice it first. Uh, don't pay for it. Uh. Practice it. Uh, free, free tools first. Then you, if you want more, then you go and go and do it. No, no point do it once a month. Uh, then you go and pay for it. If you just come in for once a month, charge GPT, then you want to buy the, the paid version. Why, why you waste some money? You know, might as well use a, a free version. So let me just give you the difference between chat GPT and Google's Google search. Okay. Chat GPT is a conversational. You ask a question, the next question, you uh the next prompt you put in, you don't need to copy the whole thing. Uh the GPT will know, the chat GPT will know what. What you uh, what is your your topics about? Huh? So you you say 
can I can know can I know more? Then the chat GPT will not ask you what do you want to know. So he he knows. Whereas in Google is different. Once you put a question there, you give it an answer. Then the next time you say any more, then you will ask you. I don't know what you're talking about. It's a Q and A. Eh? You ask a question, they give an answer. Where ChatGPT is a conversational, you know, and they they will answer you until you have no more question. Okay, that's it. They ask you to give me a score. Am I good? No, just give me a score. That's it. Uh, excuse me, Rob Sir, uh, Sifu. Uh, yes. yes this one wrong. is right. Yes. Right. Oh, thank you, thank you. I am uh, for. Uh, I just uh, interrupt to Rob Sir. Sorry, uh, uh, apologize to me. Uh, I no just problem. make sure for this one. That's why I asked uh, Sifu. Sifu is more the answer man than I am. So no. that's good you asked. Him. All right. Uh, let's see what else we got in terms of uh, Q and A. I'm sorry, Rob. I still have another question for. Yeah, of course, <laughs> go ahead. No, go ahead. Sorry. Uh, um, Francis, um, in the uh, was it uh, yesterday you told us that if we wanted um, pictures, we could go to Unpassive um, um, website and um, download. No, no, no. Um, uh, you go to Google search. You put you type in Unpassive image. Yeah? One word or two words. Unpass Unpassive image, and it will pop up all the image. Oh, okay, 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 okay. No, not oh. in on passive, but in Google, on okay. passive image. Okay, thank you. <laughs> All right, thanks. Anything else, uh, Loni? No, that's it. Thank you so much. All right, thanks for being here. We appreciate you very much. Thank and you. Your questions are always good. Thank you. Oh, uh, Chris is at it again. All right. <laughs> All right. Way to go. Yabba dabba do back to you. All right, let's see uh, if anybody else has a, uh, a question or a comment. Uh, we're here for you guys uh, as long as you want to have us. Um, it's, uh, let's see, in Singapore, it's, uh, what the heck time is it? It's, not, it's only 11, it's going on 11 a.m., so, you know, it's not even lunchtime there yet. We're just getting warmed up in Asia Pacific, that's for sure. And we're still warmed up here. That's the way I look at it. We're ready to rumble. So I don't see any other questions. We've now gone, uh, let's see. Uh, let's see, a little over two hours. We have Ooh, two and a half hours. We have people to teach. What's that now? We have, a couple, we have two people who want to teach signs. Okay, certainly do the sign. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Okay, we're going to start with, hold on, let me look at the list here. We have um, Cecil, is he here? Oh yeah, I see Cecil and Deb. Both are good. They have very short lists, so that's fine. I think it's, we'll go ahead. And we will start with Cecil. Start with Cecil. Going to the side view? Yeah, gotta wait for him to look up. Ready, Cecil? Oh, here's a one moment. He's getting ready. And then after Cecil, we'll have um, Deb. Oh, he's posting in the group. Okay, so his sign list, he's posting now in our Rob Roblin Live chat. Okay, let me change the view. One minute, one minute. Everybody keep muted. Roll up and down. He says, hello. Remember, roll up and down until you see Cecil. Do you guys see Cecil now? Mm -hmm. Are you ready to sign? Hello, everybody. Everybody good? All good. Okay, the first sign is, let me look at my list. Beach. 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 
stand, stand, stand. Island, the letter I on your palm. Island. Next word is waterfall. Waterfall. Water. Water. Fall. Water. Fall. Next word is wave, wave, wave. Tsunami is showing the big waves overcoming the land. Tsunami, tsunami, wave, tsunami. Drip. Boil water, boil water, water, boil water. Next we have shower, shower, the water coming on your head, right? It's a shower, shower. Next, we have draining, draining, draining. Wash room, the letter, is it A? Wash room. Washroom. Toilet paper. Letter T, shake the letter T, and then the sign for paper. 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 Chair. 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 The shape of the hand is this and chair. Table, table, table. Couch, couch. Love feet, love Love, feet. Rocking chair. The motion of the chair rocking. Rocking chair. Swinging. Swinging. Yay. Thank you. Say love to everybody. Thank you. Okay, now let's go ahead and take a picture. This sign before Cecil. Where's Cecil? Oh, there is. Okay, he wants us to sign tsunami, and we'll take a picture, a group picture. Again, it's this sign. It's the waves overcoming the land. Tsunami. Wiggle those fingers and go forward. All right. And ready? A picture okay everybody gonna sign this tsunami all right let me change the view i'm gonna go to fit view yeah it looks better on fit view ready one two three now very good yep looks good let me save it Thank you, Cecil. Okay, let's now go to Deb.
Oh, oh. Yeah. Been picking molars again for this topic. Okay. We're going to have describe. Describe. All connect. All connect. You want to subscribe, all connect. Platform, it's almost like table. You have to say platform. Conference, conference, having a meeting. Conference. Webinar, webinar, two hands, webinar. Speaker, 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 participant, P, go in, invite, invite, you bring someone in, invite, attendees, Attendees, if people were going to join attendees. Hosts, hosts, hosts. Want to be co hosts, C O hosts, co hosts. Share screen, share. Screen. Share screen. White boy. Call it white. White boy. White boy. Draw. I use a little pinky. Draw. Write or you could write on the White board. Right. Sometimes on the white board they have you sign. Two fingers. Sign. You want to sign or sign in. Sign. And the last word is presentation. Presentation. It's also like a speaker. Presentation. There you go. Thank you. Let's do a picture. Which sign do we use for the picture? Yep. Where did she go? Uh oh. Oh, there she is. Okay. Let me pin you. Okay. Let's take a group picture. Which sign, Deb? Something easy to see. Um, let me look here. Uh, maybe subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Easy to see, subscribe. Okay, everybody, you, you make this hand shape, right? And you go like this. With your wrist fit, facing in, subscribe. Open, shut, open, shut, open, shut. Okay, subscribe. All right, ready for a picture? Okay, one, two, three, subscribe. It's a tough one. Tough to sign that, I know. Okay, thank you. Well, all right, I think we've uh, reached time for a song. If John's still with us, I see the baritone himself still hanging in there. And welcome to Patience. Osei Ware, she's coming in now. Hello to Patience. Anybody else? Nope, just Patience. All right. 
Well, Hi, well, everyone. Uh, I was on Facebook, listening on oh. Facebook. Oh, that's nice. We're glad yeah. you're here. I know. Thank you. Love you're you. Welcome. Let's go to John Barilla. John, tell us about the song for tonight. Okay. I accidentally told you about it a little earlier. I Actually, I... <laughs> I don't know how my mic was on. I actually had the red line through it, but you know what it could be? Uh, I came in as a speaker on my own, but Lynn also brought me in at one point when I had clicked the, so is it possible that somehow two mics were with Because my mic had a red line, but you could hear me, but to respond to you to say, it wasn't, I don't know, I had to turn my mic on. So I don't know what happened, but forgive me. I was practicing, I wasn't really practicing. I was just checking to make sure my sound was working as I'm always very concerned about. And it seems like it's all pretty good right now. So let me tell you about the song, uh, but I do apologize anyway. So anyhow, now it's Willie Nelson, Willie Nelson night again. I really like Willie Nelson. Uh, and uh, uh, we've actually done things uh, by him or, uh, you know, with, uh, things he's written, whatever, but, uh, uh, tonight I'm going to do uh, a Willie Nelson song, and it's uh, a pretty big hit for him. Uh, and uh, that song is uh, On the Road Again, uh, which is what Willie does a lot, has done a lot, and he wrote the song. So I'll just tell you a little bit. In 1980, uh, Willie Nelson starred in his first leading role in a motion picture, it was a Jerry Schatzberg directed film called Honeysuckle Rose. And it was about an aging musician who fails to achieve national fame and his relationship with his family. Now, who also are part of his band that travels throughout the United States while playing in different venues. And uh, so anyway, uh, he actually started in the movie kind of playing, although he certainly has made it big time, but he's playing kind of a guy like himself, uh, very much so. And it was very good, by the way. I saw it. But at any rate, uh, the song uh, in the movie, the song was released uh, in Nelson's 1980 album, Honeysuckle Rose. In fact, the film was called Honeysuckle Rose that he starred in. And now uh, it, it, it reached the position of Billboard's top country albums while it ranked 20 on the Billboard Hot 100. Nelson received a Grammy Award for Best Country Song for this song while he was nominated for Best Original Song during the 53, 53rd I'm sorry, Annual Academy Awards. Uh, in 2004, Rolling Stone ranked at number 471 on the list of the 500 greatest songs of all time. That's, you know, 500, you're up there in 470, but... 500 greatest songs of all time is a pretty good thing, you know? So uh, that's that's uh, for On the Road again. And and the way that it, the song came about literally was that after they started to work on the film, the producer of the film actually was speaking to Willie Nelson on a flight somewhere. I don't know where they were going, but he actually suggested to him that he would like to have a song for the movie that was kind of the theme of the movie and so Willie actually said oh sure he wrote on the road again which is what the character in the movie does, does all the time and it says that he wrote the song quickly in a few minutes on the back of the barf bag what <laughs> yeah you know the barf bags that you have in an airplane that they put in the little you can uh, yeah that's what he wrote the song on the barf bag I just thought that was kind of amusing so let's sing that song that was written on a barf bag what do you say all right let's do that so this is on the road again let me just make sure everything's still working for me it's gonna be on the road again by oh not only singing it of course but as we know written by Willie Nelson. Okay, here we go. On the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. The life I love is making music with my friends. And I can't wait to get on the road again. On the road again. Going places that I've never been Seeing things that I may never see again I can't wait to get on the road again On the road again 
Like a band of gypsies, we go down the highway with the best of friends, insisting that the world keep turning our way and our way on the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. The life I love is making music with my friends. And I can't wait to get on the road again. Oh, yeah. I'm on the road again. Oh, yeah. I'm making music with my friends. I can't wait to get on that road again. I'm on the road. Making music with my friends. On the road again. On the road again. Like a band of gypsies, we go down the highway. We're the best of friends. Insisting that the world keeps turning our way. Ah, our way. And on that road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. The life I love is making music with my friends. And I can't wait to get on the road again. And I can't wait to get on the road again. On the road again. Willie Nelson. Thank you. All right. On the road again. Yeah. All right, uh, we're now, uh, whoa, a little over three hours. Hello, Zanza. Fantastic. Oh, Glass. Namaste, Namaskar. Namaste, Namaste, sir. Fantastic. Beautiful song. Beautiful Energy. song. Energy. Yes. All right, all right, all right. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, well, uh, we're as I mentioned, we're right at three hours. I think now's a good time to uh, say good night, good morning, good afternoon. Uh, we'll be back. Uh, but prior to us coming back, uh, tomorrow, uh, Sunday, you have uh, uh, Heroes at 2 p.m., which will be likely a Q&A uh, and maybe a little description. And then tomorrow night at 8 p.m., you can uh, tune in to Roblin Live at 8 o'clock. All right, well, let's go to uh, a hand up from uh, DL and Dawn. Go ahead. Yeah, I just want to say great song, John. I, I know that from years ago, 1980. You're, you're right. That's uh, It's a fantastic song, very popular, actually. Yeah, I think he won an award for that as well. Oh, but, yeah. But... Uh, I, I just want to say very well done. Appreciate it. Don. Oh, well thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, thank yes, he you definitely won the award. He, he won the Grammy, uh, Best Country Song Grammy Award that year. And he also was nominated for Best Original Song in the Motion Picture Academy Awards that year. So it was a great song. Yes, definitely. Yeah, Honeysuckle Road. I remember that uh, I was out in California at the time. But uh, you're, you're right, 1980. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. All right. Well, thank you, both you, uh, DL and uh, JB, the Tin Man, JJB, the Tin Man. Uh, Francis, any closing uh, remarks? You or uh, Sifu, uh, Chris? Uh, you're muted, Francis. Go ahead. You're unmuted, Francis. I hope to see more hosts in the coming days. Let's do it. All right. I agree 100%. Tonight's training is going to bring out the best in this group. I guarantee it, Francis. Over to you, Chris. Uh, Anything let's, from you? Oh. See, oh, uh, Mel, Mel Mel is the first one who already started. On, uh, she's on the road uh, to create her own uh, new chapter for herself. Yeah. Good stuff, Mel. Good stuff. Uh, Sifu, uh, Chris, did you have any closing remarks? Did he uh, go to the comfort room? No, no, he's busy, uh, I think. He's oh, okay. Checking things out. Yeah, yeah. Uh, unmuting the other device. Yeah, oh. thank you. 
you very much for uh, everyone listening and uh, ho- ho- hope um you, everyone could uh, find the recording of our presentation today in the ONET classroom uh, OES classroom training um All right. on, yeah thank and you very much questions to join are in the chat right Chris you want to post it one more time so it's at yes, the bottom yes. that'd be good of thank course. you we would encourage you to join the OES Classroom Club, which is in ONET, because then, then you have access to the recordings of the OES trainings. All right, and Lynn wanted to get one more picture. So uh, one of these, a picture. Let's see if I can get that. Yeah. So anybody who wants to be in this final picture of the night or the day for you, go ahead and turn your camera on so you'll be in the picture. All right, let's get in the picture, everybody. Whoever wants to be in the picture. Oh, it looks like the uh, Israeli rose has a new rose. Oh, on. that's a pretty one. Red roses. Nice. Put it to the side of you so we can see your face, though, Carmela. Put it right to the side so we see your pretty face. Yeah, that's better. There we go. All right, everybody. Let's Carmela get ready has for to have Pardon? a club, a club of uh, flowers. There are a couple of flower clubs. There's... Uh, Weed in my garden. I know of that one I'm in. And then there's a couple other flower clubs. I think Melanie has a gardening. Melanie's got a gardening club. Right, yeah. Mel? right. Mel has Garden. one. What's the name of your club, Mel? It's Mel. Oh, sorry. Aldo and Indo Garden. Mel's Aldo oh, Indo Garden. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Awesome. All right, let's get ready for a picture. And patience, since you love that stuff, you should have your own club, patience. <laughs> I will. <laughs> can, can I add in one, one announcement? Uh, those of you who are interested to understand about O Verified, uh, I will be speaking at the Indian group to, uh, tomorrow morning, 9 30 a.m. ETT, uh, the AI Future Internet Family Group Chat. Uh, group webinar at 9 30 a.m tomorrow uh, about all verified if you're interested thank you thank you all right we'll post it in our roblin live uh, messenger chat and we are good about posting it in the various whatsapp groups and telegram groups and it will also be posted in the back office but you know all verify is coming so it's a good time for us to get familiar with what it is and how it works. I think it'd be to our advantage, definitely. So thank when you, Francis. Sorry, Ray, I, I didn't cut across. When? When? What day? Tomorrow? Tomorrow yeah. 9.30. Oh, I'll be at work. It is at, uh, oh, it's called, the group is called OPAI Future Internet Family and the time is, I have it here, EDT, 9.30 a.m. So I here, nine. <laughs> yes, I already uh, uh, sent it in the chat here. Oh, okay, in the look group in the chat. chat. We'll India time will be 7 p.m. It's a good time for India, really. Yeah, most, okay. most of the people there are in our loving life. And yeah. if you want to see Sadananda Das, my friend yeah. in India, exactly. go there. So the host. <laughs> The host of this is uh, Vilas Chakraborty, and he's often here in our show and in OES. He's a strong supporter, and uh, you'll see you'll see familiar faces when you go there. All right, let's get ready for the final picture of the evening. If uh, those of you who haven't turned your camera on, Srijit and uh, Uniloni, please do if you'd like to be in this last picture. Thank okay. you. All right, here we go. There's Arm and All right, people are popping up. If you want to do the I love you, I, international I love sign, you. I love you, Bilash, I love you. Do this. Copy me, Bilash. Do this. Do this. There. One. Okay, one more finger. This finger. This finger. There. He got it. He got it. Right. All right. Ready? I'm three. One. Where Camilla, where's your hand? You can't see it. It's behind your roses. <laughs> there we go. Okay. One, two, three. Right now. Ready. Thank you. It will go into the chat, the messenger 
Rodman Live. All right. Good to see you, Srija. Thanks for being here, brother. All right. Let's uh, let's uh, uh, let's uh, let's say a fond farewell to everybody. Uh, I do want to say, as I do tonight, thank you to all military veterans around the globe. Thank you to all military active duty around the globe. Uh, thank you to all first responders, and thank you, Francis and Chris, of course, and thank you to all of you for being here tonight. Much appreciated. Let's unmute and let's say arrivederci. Well, goodbye, good night, good morning, good afternoon. Goodbye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. 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 All right, here we go on the count of three. One, two, three. One, two, three. We are so in it to win it. We are seventy minutes. Unpassive. Zindabad. <laughs>